James O'Sullivan, do you have a favorite DJ Dabble song? No, I don't. I don't even know who the fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. Fucking at is. Fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. Fucking at is. Fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. I don't even know who the fucking at is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who the fucking at is. 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 Fucking at is. Fucking at is. I don't know who the fucking at is. I don't know who the fucking at is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who the fucking at is. 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 Fucking at is. Fucking at is. I don't know who the fucking at is. I don't know who the fucking at is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who the fucking at is. 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 Fucking at is. Fucking at is. I don't know who the fucking at is. I don't know who the fucking at is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who the fucking at is. 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 Fucking at is. Fucking at is. Honest with me, sodomy. I don't mean beautiful. I don't mean blind. I don't mean super chat. Hold it over John I don't mean beautiful. I don't mean poor. Super chat truly shown two days before. I don't mean beautiful. I don't mean blind. I don't mean super chat. Hold it over John I don't mean beautiful. I don't mean poor. Super chat truly shown two days before. I don't mean beautiful. I don't mean blind. I don't mean super chat for little over John I. I don't mean beautiful. I don't mean poor. Super chat truly showed two days before. I don't mean beautiful. Very, very beautiful. 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 Very, very beautiful. I don't mean lie. Very big lie. 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 Very big lie. Broken I am broken brain, broken penis, broken brain, broken finger, broken brain, broken asshole, broken brain, broken I am broken brain, smelly penis, broken brain, smelly finger, broken brain, broken, 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 I don't mean beautiful, I don't mean why, I don't mean super chat for little over John I don't mean beautiful, I don't mean poor, super chat truly show two days before. I don't mean beautiful, I don't mean why, I don't mean super chat for little over John I I don't mean beautiful, I don't mean poor. Super chat truly showed two days before. Me expect big super chats out of me. You want it my sway? You know what? You want it my sway? You know what? You want it my sway? You know what? You want it my sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? You know what? You want it my sway? You know what? You want it my sway? You know what? You want it my sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? You know what? You want it my sway? No what? You want it my sway? No what? You want it? I'm the best cooker in the fuck world. My sway, fuck sauce. You want it my sway? Tomato. My sway, fuck sauce. You want it my sway? My sway? I know this. My sway, fuck sauce. You want it my sway? Tomato. My sway, fuck sauce. You want it my sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? Fuck sauce. You want it my sway? Tomato. My sway, fuck sauce. You want it my sway? My sway? I know this. My sway? Fuck sauce. Lettuce. You want it my sway? Tomato. My sway? Fuck sauce. Lettuce. You want it my sway? My sway? My sway? My sway? Bob's Kitchen. We give you extra napkins. Liberals are cheap fucks. Why is that, John? Why is that? I don't know. I think they give a lot of their money to charity. 
He just bought me two pints at the pub, two pints at the pub, two pints at the pub, two pints at the pints at the pints at the pub, two pints at the pub, two pints at the pub, two He just bought me two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the pints at the pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club. Am I hallucinating here? Two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the pints at the pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two he just bought me two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the pints at the pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two he just bought me two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the pints at the pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two he just bought me two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the pints at the pints at the club, two pints at the club, two pints at the club. I don't turn down free beer. Can you show me a picture? I told the world. Fucking cowards. I told the world. as a child, I was bullied as a father, but in elementary school, that is an act of violence. Hey, yo, he's fucking with my guests, fucking with my friends, fucking with my family, that is an act of violence. I told the world, fucking coward. I told the world, I done with kids name, I done with Facebook, I done with Instagram, I done with LinkedIn, I done with phone number having a Twitter war. I done with white scene, I done with kids name, I done with Facebook, I done with Instagram, I done with LinkedIn, I done with phone number having a Twitter war. I hope the world I'm old school. I don't believe in anonymity. Uh. <laughs> it's time for the Uncle Rico Show. It's time for the Uncle Rico Show. So chug a cause, cause here we go. It's time. Boom! We're doing it. Yeah, baby. We are doing it. Ladies and gentlemen, the gruesome twosome are here. My man, Mike Morse. Why, hello. And me, welcome to... Come on, man! Emergency... Hey. <laughs> Come on, man! We'll get Emergency... It. <laughs> God damn it. Come on, man! This is it. Emergency... 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 <sighs> Emergency show... Nope. Emergency show... Nope. Come on, man! You got Emergency it. Emergency show... This is it. Midnight. <laughs> Let's do it. Come on now. <laughs> Not exactly the right time, Mule, but thank you. Oh, Mule updated us with a new one for tonight's show. Ooh, sweet. Hold on. I didn't see this. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> it's a double emergency show, people. <laughs> emergency show, people. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> ah, the best mule, everybody. Oh. Give him a follow on Twitter. Give him some love. Hello, everyone. Welcome. Uh, we're coming up on 700 here at tip off. Thank you what? for uh, being here. Thank you for joining. Uh, well, you didn't join, but here's what I need you to do, because I think we're like five away. 
subscribe. Hit subscribe. I think we're like five or six away from getting to 18,000. So if you want to do that, that won't cost you anything. Hit the like button. That helps uh, the, the program from what I'm told. <clears throat> And then uh, do yourself a favor and member up. Get yourself a membership. We got you make the call. We got some good ones for this weekend. We'll be doing some a few of those. I'll be doing them. Uh, Mike, if you're around, you want to join, you're more than welcome sure. to. Uh, but uh, that's where you guys make the call on possibly uh, upcoming Dabby categories. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, yeah. There's a lot, a lot of stuff we have in the works for this weekend. Best can throw. Uh, uh, what, what were some of the other ones you're working on? Best Maybe zoom not. in. I started yeah. noticing there's a lot of zooms, you know, there's different reasons for them, but there's just a lot of them. So, mm -hmm. uh, so we got hand best throw, hand throw, can throw, zoom insults, in, insults, worst Ins insult. <laughs> oh, insults <laughs> are gonna be good. So, it's up to you guys. What we'll do is we'll have like 10 clips or so and we'll play them, and you, the chat. Make the call on what's the top five, and those will be our nominees uh, for that category. So you'll help us produce the dabbies, if you if you will, daddy. Uh, so, yes, thank you, everybody. Uh, member up. Get yourself a membership. Five gets you in. Ten gets you everything. You get access to the world. Discord, old shows, new shows, uh, bonus shows, uh, unbonus shows, all the, all the works. Every show. A lot of shows. Too much, people have said. They go, please, how do I get out of here? There's too much going on. And I don't blame them. Mm -hmm. uh, another channel that has a lot going on, this uh, Generation XP on YouTube. This this guy's a machine. He doesn't stop. He has another uh, John revelation. Wow. Check this out. How many albums has Stuttering John sold? Information about sales figures for Stuttering John's albums is difficult to find. Mm. There's no mention of sales numbers on reliable sources like All Music or his Wikipedia page. While commercially unsuccessful, Stuttering John did release two albums, Stuttering John and Everybody's Normal But Me. Reviews tend to be negative, though some find them entertaining in a campy way. Campy is code word for garbage, John. Your music was garbage. <laughs> wow, it's an opinionated uh, robot. Uh, wow. At the end, she really hammers yeah. home the truth, huh? Wow. <laughs> that must She's be. doing community notes at the end. <laughs> <laughs> she, that's somebody's wife is what that is. I can hear it in that tone. Uh, <laughs> uh, all right. So listen, let's get to some of these super chats. Thank you, everybody. Uh-oh. Take a Ooh. break. The walls are covered in love and fuck sauce. It's Josh and Kim Johnson. Suck gift my dick. Uh, uh, I swallow cum. Thank me. Oh, hey, Did I hey, mention... Hey. <laughs> Sorry, did I mention you can be gifted a membership? I don't think I did. Uh, you have the kindness of the Johnsons where they come up for air from banging like monkeys and then they gift memberships. And how do you get them? Well, you turn on accept gifted memberships, the link that will take you to your settings to do that. Just like Josh turns on Kim and Kim turns on Josh. Mm. On notification. Mm -hmm. There you go. Uh, Magellan gift in five. There you go. To the barbecue restaurant. That's 15 people behind the wall now. All right. I super chatted stuttering. Oh, Eugene. Thank you, brother. Uh, I super chatted stuttering John 10 bucks. So I owe you 20 as penance. I asked why he didn't buy Kleenex. And if anyone ever taught him how to blow his nose, <laughs> he didn't answer either question wow. for 10 bucks. He at least give you the lame fucking horn. Something. What an asshole. Uh, Rev Fugly, my brother's name is Bob, and I can't stop talking like Joey C to him. I hear you, Bob. <laughs> I think he's about to yeah, my wife, too. When I started doing the Joey C impression, I started doing it around that. I've always done the impressions around the house, talk to the kids, talk to the wife. Kids always love the impressions. Wife, never a huge fan. <laughs> um, trying to think which whack pack impression she hated the most that I used to do around the house. I think it was Jeff. I think she, she never, hated Jeff the most. She never asked you to do one in bed. Could you do Beatles? No, on no. <laughs> <laughs> I've always wanted to bang sour shoes. Ooh, ooh. I'm on top of it. <laughs> Bob, please explain why they don't run well in snow. <laughs> He's not here. Not here tonight. Uh, nerdy shirt gifted one. Thank you, nerd. Appreciate you it, buddy. Dumb fuck. <laughs> The Rev Fugly gift in one. 
I like how John said today, I was watching him. He's getting hammered tonight, too. He said, he goes, I don't give a fuck. He was drunk last night. I love yeah. that. Like tonight right. is, is a crazy weird night where he's going to get drunk. But uh, he said to Rev Fugly, he goes, yeah, I like how you Photoshop my picture. The only thing Photoshopped <laughs> is the hat. Everything <laughs> else is real. <laughs> That's <funny. laughs> Uh, Woody, a few weeks ago, you said you'd love to have me on Blunder Years of Rico. I was truly flattered by that. Truly, thank you. Any excuse to goof on uh, Schmegma Boy? I like that. Thank you, Woody. Uh, Nordic Born Gift in One. This guy's on fire. On fire. Any truth to the rumor that Bob is Eddie Money? He's a little runaway tonight. Uh, Josh and Kim Johnson with 100 bones. Get out of here. It's Friday, and we're so excited to kick it off with some drinks and listening to you guys. This is Mrs. J, by the way. All hail oh, the Miss, the, the real boss of the operation here. Notice he's allowed to just give 10. Yeah. She's dropping a, a, a hundred on here going, excuse me while I whip this out, honey. Good for you, Mrs. Johnson. To Mrs. Johnson oh, with round dice. Well, I got to get me a drink. I don't even have one. God damn it. Uh, my he, uh, uh, I swallow cum. Thank me. Penis is 100% right. Uh, he is. Uh, 1971 Puffy, our pal, gift and 10. We love you, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, I bought one stuttering John Band CD. You signed it in, in Rochester. It, oh, and right. I did. Oh, I signed it. Wow. Chase. That's awesome. I didn't know. I signed it. I signed his CD. Be great if he goes anywhere where you could bring that and have him sign it and he opens it up and sees my signature. Oh, that'd oh. be great. Uh, Chris Hall, I'm sick of everyone treating this drunk with kid gloves. It's time, Shuli. He's too confident and smug. Really let loose. There's no high road when you're dealing with a pig man. All roads are feces. Well, listen, Zen's not here to defend himself, Chris. I don't think this is uh, warranted. To be honest with you, I don't know what Zen did, but uh, we'll address it. We'll address it. Uh, Frog and Don show, please. All super chats are split 50 50. Uh, uh, Frog, can you stop super chatting from your account, please? Thank you. Uh, Real Z. Oh my God. Uh, I swallow cum. Thank me. Oh, hey, my Nambler representative. I mean, you look at this face and you go, that guy knows ham. Yeah. You know what I mean? He knows looks a cold like, cut. Looks like an insurance agent who just tells you that the hurricane is not covered, uh, that destroyed your house. <laughs> he goes, well, that's why people get flood insurance. What do you think, stupid? <laughs> yeah, he and he doesn't have a face that lets you down easy either. No. He would be like, uh, well, that's why you're an idiot and now you're homeless. Yeah. Uh, Sharon Gifton five. Thank you, Sharon. Appreciate <laughs> that. <laughs> uh, all right. We got a doozy. He drank. <laughs> oh, Shocking. hold on. I'm looking on the separate channel. Sex in the city's on right now. What are the girls up to? Oh, <laughs> look at you ladies having a little party tonight. Two Samantha's. I, I see a lot of hat wears tonight. Yeah. <laughs> You think he stapled it to his head so John won't take it off ever again? Uh, all right, let's get into this. So John, last yesterday's show, uh, drank, he yelled, he screamed, uh, bodily fluids happened, a lot happened. So we got a lot to get to, Mike. We got some people stopping by in a little while. Uh, so sit back, relax, everybody, get comfy, cozy, all right? Because we're 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 doing it tonight, ladies and gentlemen. It is time, one and all, for the Uncle Rico show. Hey, everybody! How are you? Little little fondue today, I see. Fondue. fondue. Uh, I wish I wish he had yeah. cheese melting all over his face right now. <laughs> what did he mean? Did he mean pompadour? Ha hairdo fondue 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 i i i uh... cheese head <laughs> fondue comes out of his ass uh... <laughs> wow 
Fun, dude. All right. I mean, we are 11 seconds in. Wow. Hey, everybody. How are you? Little, little fondue today, I see. Uh, and and that's the most sober he's going to be in this episode, oh, folks. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, fucking hell. Uh-oh. Already. Kevin was going fucking hours. Pompadour? Like Is that on, what man. he was trying to I say? Think he was trying to say Pompadour. That's where all... <laughs> and, and this fucking thing already. Skull! I do. <laughs> Buffon. Talk about. Talk about. First of all, the reason why I played the hypocrisy, please. <laughs> I mean, I'm still stuck on it. Yeah. Buffon to fondue. <laughs> can you even get? Um, let me see that map. Can you even get there from here? I don't think you can. Silent Mike. Yeah. Uh oh. I'm gonna tell you something. Okay. Uh oh. I never got arrested for not paying child support. Okay. Okay. Cool. Hey, man. Way to way to Ooh. way to be honest about things, Johnny. Thanks for sharing, man. Sit down. That was an allegation <laughs> made by my ex-wife. Whoa! Yeah. I didn't know that. I thought Reddit made those claims yeah, that okay. that he got arrested. She? Why would she? Why would she make those claims? Well, they have a great relationship, so of course that's what would happen. That's weird. Yeah. You didn't read my response to any of the allegations. You only read what you wanted to read. <laughs> I didn't read anything. But why you're a big <laughs> fuck? I can't even read, you big fucking dummy. What do you think of that? Fucking hypocrite. Mm -hmm. How are you? It's because you know who did go to jail? Mike, you went to jail <laughs> for child support? I, how did this get out? Oh, no. For not paying child support, you dumb fuck. Okay. Bob Levy. Oh, you're yeah, right. Bob Levy. <laughs> oh, which makes Mike a hypocrite. Got it. Right. Got it. What? You mean a story that Bob's told a million times again, again with this guy and yeah. his breaking news and his scoops that, uh, that, <laughs> that he's got on everybody. Uh-oh. Bob went to jail for child. Wow. Ooh. I hope Bob doesn't hear about this. Right. Let's check in what's going on on their show. It looks exciting. All right. Same thing. Let's get back Bob to fucking Levy. Heard of him? Your co-host. Mm. He went to jail for not paying child support. Okay. So next time, maybe you figure that out before you open your unfunny mouth, you fucking twit. <laughs> Ouch, John. Skull. Skull, John. It's fun seeing him halfway through a sentence realize you see the look on his face. It's a good day today. And he doesn't know how it's going <laughs> to <Okay>. end. <laughs> and then he then he ends it with, it's, so today's a great day. A lot of birds out today. Ah. So. <laughs> it's going to be partly right cloudy so at about 75 degrees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, he's like a radio guy who's being prank call. He's like, we will call the FBI and we'll get you arrested, fella. <laughs> 22 past the hour, 72 degrees in the city. The death of anybody. Huh? But this time I will. Justice is finally served. <laughs> Rest in peace, Nicole Brown Simpson and Ron Goldman. They died? And I am, you know, I can't <laughs> tell you how upset I was. I remember it was me and Suzanne, a bunch of my friends at our apartment, our high rise <laughs> in the sky on the east side. Ugh. And we watched that OJ trial and I could not fucking believe that jury fucking believed Johnny Cochran's horse shit. Hot take, Melendez. Nobody's ever talked about this. And they Wait, so he's trying to say that he didn't think uh, that he thought OJ was actually guilty. Yes, wow. that's right. That's that right. Bold move. He's, yeah, him not guilty. Well, guess what? God rules on you now, uh, oh. Jesus, man. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. It was like how many years after the the yeah. murder? It's like yeah. we'll get there. We'll get I mean, there. The Heisman but Trophy. Uh, <laughs> professional football player, movie star, right? Uh, who guy got away with two, murder? Yeah, guy killed two people. You know how much time he spent in jail? Uh, uh, what he spent in jail for? 
Heisman Trophy, memorabilia. <laughs> That's what he went to jail back. for. <laughs> he cut two people's heads off, and he went to jail for memorabilia. <laughs> you think John's <laughs> going to make it to 76? I don't think Oh, so. no, 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 no. <laughs> That's the may I speak to your manager face? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You fucking psychopath. So I'm fucking I'm ecstatic. Looks like it. Now you did <laughs> live 76 years, but you spent quite like I don't know. <laughs> How many years did he spend behind bars? He was incarcerated the whole trial. That was like <laughs> a year or two, right? And then he got arrested for his sports member, Billy, in Vegas. So, um, that's right, Jerry. Oh, my Lord, this is quite the tenseless. I see OJ, and he be scared. <laughs> I put that guy through on the phone. I remember I was with Channel 9 producer Dan Foreman. We were editing my clips from Last Call, the show that I co-hosted. On CBS for Brandon Tartikoff. <laughs> Shit, way up. Why was Dan Foreman you. from Channel 9 doing it? Yeah, yeah. Well, because guess what? Uh, superstar over here, he can't be bothered to learn how to edit. Another yeah, if one. But wait, if he's co-hosting a show, he shouldn't have it. They have people to do that. Uh, yeah, Absolutely. What do you think Letterman goes back and and edited yeah, Letterman? Do you think uh, Jimmy Fallon goes back and edits his stuff? No, of course not. Of course not. Co-host. I'm calling bullshit right now. Sounds like he was the the production assistant or somebody over there, but behind the scenes, you were no co-host. Stop lying, John. On my credits, I was making five G's a show. Shit, way up <laughs> with a twelve. Episode season. <laughs> Let me do the math for you, shit, Waya. Since you didn't fucking graduate high school, that's that's sixty six. I know, stupid. Sixty G's, what? shit, Waya. God damn it! God damn it! While I was working on the Stern Show, that's me, Johnny Multitask, Johnny Skill Set, Johnny Skill Set. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, John, Johnny not doing the job you were supposed to be doing if he's doing that. Oh, my God. Johnny skill set. That's what I do. <laughs> yeah, Luigi, same question I had. Did anyone ask for this information? Apparently, <laughs> I did because he's yelling at me OJ. about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is OJ's eulogy, by the yeah. way. I don't settle. I like to make money. That's what I do. Mm. Have I had hard times in my life? Yes. Sure. No. When I worked for free for Stern while going to NYU and graduating. We almost graduated. Eh, I mean, no matter how loud you yell, it doesn't make it real, dude. I was making zero. But. And you were overpaid. Shit way up. Unlike you, What's I immediately problem? rose to Stern fame. And within a year, mm -hmm. I became a household name in the Stern universe. Yeah. And then I... You're still a household name. Uh, my wife the other day goes, one of the cats took a John on the carpet. You need to clean it. I go, all right. Started booking appearances. <laughs> Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday night, 750, 750 a clip. <laughs> and I'll never forget. I didn't ask about any of this, by the way. He's no. so... He's so, uh, you this know, is OJ just, eulogy. Don't this worry is about o, it. It started as OJ. And it went to a person even more despicable than OJ, me. <laughs> then ah. I fucking mm -hmm. said to Baba Booey after I did a gig in, uh, what was it? Some big club in Rockland County or in, no, in, oh, it was, it was, it was in Rye, New York. They had a big ah. club. Mm -hmm. Oh, that one. Good thing you mm -hmm. remembered. I was going to say this is bullshit. And I got paid $750, and there was a 1,000 people paying to be in there. And they were paying to see me. And I came back to Baba Buai and said, Gary, 
from the school. Right. You and Jack, I got to well, Hold for a second. So he, there he is. Yeah. He's working on the Stern Show. Has to be in there at, what, 5.30 he was supposed to be in, right? Yeah. Yeah. So, and he's out all night. He said he was well, doing Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Also, keep in mind, if he has tape from interviews that he got the night before, he probably should be in earlier to get mm -hmm. it edited and ready to go for Howard to play that day or at least right. have first thing the next morning and get it done and out of the way. You know, yeah, that's what I would do. Yeah. But I didn't rise to stern fame like he yeah, did. Really. So, you know, what do I know? I know how to edit. Mm -hmm. You know, I wasn't... Ex I wasn't expecting that, Shuli. Zen is terrible. I agree. Yeah, no, I know who you're talking about, Chris. Don't worry about it. I am the one who knows Ham, for I am Ham. He is Ham Head. <laughs> Wait. Ham Head. Ham Head. Ham Head. Ham Head. Ham Head. Ham Head. Oh, I like that. Mess around with that later. Uh, Repo Cat, let's all member up and support. Yeah. You heard them. Let's do it. Come on. Turn on accept gifted memberships. Link is in the description or member up yourself. Meredith is throwing them out. Look, she's gifting one. Thank you, Meredith. Here's Half Penny. Hey, yeah. Coming up on a thousand live viewers, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Want to check in and uh, see what the broads are up to over on John's show? Oh, same shit. Shocking. Yeah, nothing. Um, what do we got here? Best album of all time, Beach Boys. Just go away, Frog. <laughs> I stand by it. Uh, you should stand under it and hope, hopefully it runs over you. <laughs> but <laughs> that was great. In starring John's voice, violets are red, roses are blue. You weigh shit and I clean it off a shoe. <laughs> Brothers and shit in the dabble verse two. Let's be friends. I love, I love you. you. Frankly, thank you. Beautiful poetry <laughs> for great. nine month member. Frankly, thank you, buddy. All support is paid through the state. It's a fact. That's right, Billy Mac. Mm -hmm. Thank you, buddy. Uh, Seven Large Army, breaking news. Silent Mike didn't say his first word until he was three years old. My PI <laughs> Dustin told me, Mike. <laughs> wow. Very true. Uh, I hung a framed diploma today. Ink was still wet. Mm. Wow, Guillermo, <laughs> revealing all the secrets today. Thank you. Stuttering, Stuttering John had hard times, <laughs> daddy. It, it shows. It looks like he did. Last call hosts include Tad Lowe. Who's Tad? Is that Rob's brother? I think so, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Critic Elvis Mitchell, editor Terry McDonald, actress Brianna Leary, and London Times Sue Elli Ellicott uh, per wiki. Wow. So he wasn't. No, he said he was a co-host, APAR. Check co-host, buddy. See what comes up. Are those sores above his lip or did he miss a couple spots shaving? Oof, we'll knows? go and check that, Reels. But it could be he was making out with Brennan. And you know how it's oh, transferred. Stacey Allen says that Chad Lowe is probably who he's talking oh, about. Oh, that's, that's who I'm talking Okay. Uh, why does his hand look extra mummified today? Great question. We'll dive into that as well. Donna G gift in one. Ooh. What? And a two. There's four bucks. And thank you. Stuttering John evaded taxes. Proof. His coworker Cabby did. There you go. That's some John logic right there. there is. On that front, I just want to say this, you know, they're still talking about the, uh, phone call you know, that was made to the bar mm -hmm. and how, you know, jail time is still a real possibility. Mm -hmm. um, and John says it doesn't matter that the call was made. It's the two-party state takes precedence mm -hmm. in that. And uh, I thought, well, that's interesting. So that would mean his call to Trump, he broke the law. He will have to. And yeah. I believe during his podcast with Royce, correct me if I'm wrong, Dabbleverse, you guys know better than I do, but didn't they call the Stern Show back office on the podcast and air that without letting people know that they were on a show mm. or recording? I believe they did. Wow. So, so that's that's double whammy. Yeah. So, you know, I mean, if we're going to start talking law here. Yeah. We'll start as a good law. lawyer. <laughs> that's right. That's right. Call one at least. Dang lizard. John, do you know 
uh, how we know that you didn't pay child support, you told us. Mm -hmm. While your ex claimed, you said you did not pay during the right. dispute. Oh, that really? is correct. Court records claim that as well, but John will tell you those records are very one-sided. Hmm. Very one-sided. Uh, thank Mr. White. Thanks for the seven months of laughter, bad drum talk, and the legend <laughs> Bob motherfucking Levy. Love you, Bob. Mr. White, thank I you, I love sir. you, Bob. That's what I'm talking about, John Bob. Uh, Louis Zamora, 11 months, almost a year of crapping all over the turd burger that is known as stuttering failure, John Melendez. Skull, gentlemen, TSN is the best. Thank you, Louis. Thank you for your support. Uh, Tiger Lily, now that OJ is gone, John is number one on my hate list. <laughs> Angry Skull. Enjoy. Enjoy. Look at that, John. You... You passed another test. Number mm -hmm. one on a list. Pet Frog, uh, Pet Frog <laughs> sounds yeah. was a good album. Pet Frog sounds. That's good. Uh, Mr. White, gift in one. Boom. And two. Werner Von Braun. Thank you. This is why I told you guys, uh, turn on accept gifted memberships and like the coward button, guys. Please. Thank yeah. you. All right. Let's get back into it. Where'd it go? Here it is. We have to be fucking, you know, um, mm -hmm. defiant. We have, Ooh, there's a we have to do this in solidarity. Oh, stop, stop. Don't, Ooh, he's got, oh, on his both finger, of us. he's got a, he's got a, see, right, uh, right there. Ooh. Oh, this yeah, thing that's up here. That's from that. That's from doing that. Wow. That's wow. He's really digging into Steve. that finger. Yeah. He's jamming that nail in there. Oof. Now you would think if you do that, if it's a bad habit, it's a nervous habit. Obviously, you cut you, you cut your your thumbnail. Yeah. So you can't do that. Then again, it, it maybe it makes that part of his finger like like it's like a <laughs> bulletproof now. It's like Kevlar. <laughs> He's got a callus. Somebody shoots at him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like no, he'll stop a robbery with that. Like Wonder thing. Woman's bracelet. <laughs> Darity. <laughs> Pause. Somebody wrote. <laughs> <laughs> Pause. Uh, Don't both of us. <clears throat> our prices will always be fifteen hundred. This way, they can't try and get one of us for cheaper. Bob Bowie's like, I showed you. That sounds like a lot of money. I said, <clears throat> Bowie, are you an idiot? Come here, Bowie. Come here. <clears throat> Bowie, oh, you hit. You hit. You hit. We're worth it. Okay. Yeah, that's animal abuse. Yeah, they they're Call gonna Peter. pay. <laughs> call PETA and tell him this guy was just slapping a monkey around at appearances. Yep, they did. And then that 750 a night went to 15 hundy. That's right. Shit where? So I was making six G's a week. I think he does have Within a... Within a year or two on Stern. He does have a fever sore right there. Oh, yeah. Right above yeah. his top lip, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Somebody's Good been job. making out with Kevin. So, somebody, yeah. KB, look, I'm just like you. That's how I fucking started my fortune. School. <laughs> School. <laughs> That's right. You know how many rich guys I know tell me the story of how they started their oh, fortune yeah. and then chug back a 12 ounce Coors <laughs> Light? <laughs> on a blow up couch? <laughs> on, on a blow up couch. <laughs> surrounded by cat shit. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I started my fortune. <laughs> I'm the Duke of the Dabble verse. That's the only reason why. Because I'm smart. Uh, I mm. could run things. And it's always been my way or the highway. Look, dig, dig, dig. Mm. And I'm dig, telling dig, you, dig. man, shit, where? What? Just like. KB said today, I'm like, and Kev, I got to talk to you. Oh. You know, I'm oh. you want me to just wait, John? Or are you going to yeah, come back yeah. to me? Go ahead. Put a bookmark in that. He'll get bookmark back. that? All right. I'm going to go off on some Don't hold your here, and that's <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, no. Could you have any more vape in your mouth when you said that, How too? How can you tell? Boy, I can tell. Boy. It sounds like you, <laughs> It sounds like somebody shoved a potato sack over your head. Ah. Oh, hello. Oh, wow. Yeah. You just go. You sound like a can of smashed assholes. <laughs> <laughs>
Discount Don, we're over a thousand. Hit like, hit Ooh. subscribe. Are we over eighteen thousand? Answer me, you son of a bitch. We're not yet. Oh, God right damn away. you people. Uh, hit like, hit subscribe, hit notify, and member your ass up, or at least turn on accept gift and memberships. Link is in the description. Pour yourself a drink. Spark that shit up. Let's go. It's okay. I keep the show interesting. I don't need anybody to fucking pull it down. I don't want... Guests, I don't mind having eye candy on sometimes. <laughs> I get why Brennan has Felicia Gillespie, who I think is gorgeous. I do. Felicia? I don't know why you fucking freaks. Isn't her name Felicia? Yeah, that's the way a human would. <laughs> Felicia? Felicia? Did he really say it? That? Uh, hold on. <laughs> want guests. I don't mind having eye candy on sometimes. I get <laughs> why Brennan has... Felicia Gillespie, who I think is gorgeous. <laughs> I do. I don't know not, why you not fucking many freak. people know this 12, 23rd Amendment is to maintain a, a well-maintained Felicia. Felicia, that's right. Don't take our guns and we can't form a Felicia. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. I think she looks like Skeletor. I would fucking pay her to date me. Oh, I to. think Kate Meany. <laughs> you, whoever's dating you next will be making money. That I can tell yeah. you. All right. Now somebody said, and, and uh, on either side, there's the there's the um, herpy in the middle. But on either yeah. side, he, I think he's. It's like a little Fu Manchu thing he's doing. Oh please! If there's a god, let him grow a pencil mustache or try it, please. Oh, that'd be the best. Wow. Or a Fu Manchu. Either one. Just a nice thin. Oh, I love it. Hold on, Janet. Come on, guys. He made a lot of money in his time. The fact that he has absolutely zero zero of it left is a feat of amazing yeah. proportions. Give him his due. Yeah. You know what? You're right. Right. You're right. You usually have to be an 80s rapper to, to, to lose that much money. I don't know too many people that, uh, that, that could do what he did with that amount of money. Probably. Yeah. is gorgeous but she posted a picture with some dude i guess she's cheating on me i'm very oh. jelly oh, who's he oh Nothing uh, not did nauseous. he say meanie kate meanie no a uh, felicia probably no i think just oh. now he oh. said po oh, yeah. meanie posted he's a picture with about someone new now All right. yeah 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 he's he's changing lanes dude he's not using the signal just keep up but anyway kev uh oh zoom all, oh shit all up. right I mean this from the bottom oh. of my heart. What's your pick? He's been a little juicy, so I'm going to say uh, drool. Drool? I'm going to say sneeze. Shut up. Whoa. Okay? And there are two Ooh. reasons why I'm going to say shut up to you, Kev. Okay. Number one, uh -oh. I text you today to try and help you. Because when you see in the stream yard, oh, stop, during stop, the chat. stop, stop. stop. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Oh, you go back. Because that T is there even when he's... Look now. He's not even yeah, firm. Yeah, he's... Right. It, it's there. That's just... It's like almost like a tattoo at this point. <laughs> it really is. It's like permanent makeup yeah. he had put on. That's fucking... Oh, look at that fucking T. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but does that make it any better? Oh, God like, You can't unsee like, that. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna need just a, a separate drop of you can't unsee that <laughs> because when you see in the stream yard during the chats, there's a live chat which is going oh, on now. Oh my oh. god, that angle of the finger was bananas. Oh, oh. <laughs> during the ch oh. chat, there's a live. Ooh, that's like you ever see the movie Anaconda with Ice Cube, and <laughs> <laughs> all of a sudden that snake pops up. Out Hell yeah, J Lo, J Lo yeah. is looking good in that yeah. goddamn movie. But look, I think this should be the new recruitment poster for the military <laughs> in this day, this day and age. Yeah. We want you, no, the guy behind <laughs> you and to the, around you, <laughs> dog leg. I chat, which is going on now, and if I wanted, dude, hold on.
He says, take it down, YouTube will think it's a penis. You're making a joke, right? <laughs> Frog, didn't we get a strike for that? We got something for one of the memes. <laughs> yeah, it was a meme of his finger. Might have finger. been age-restricted, though. Yeah, but we got hit with something. And there was something that, that they thought it was a penis, remember? We got yeah, hit with something. One of the memes with his finger on it. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> I thought we got a strike for it, but, oh, God ridiculous <laughs> fake account I can hit Christopher <laughs> Columbus had a finger like that that's why he ended up in the West Indies <laughs> going to China over there <laughs> the starred button and then you have all the super chats and that's how I'm going to thank everyone for all their super chats today mm. so I text that to Kevin did he respond thank you no wow fuck you Kevin Angry. he's such a chick the least you could do is text me back. Thanks. What is that on the side Did of his lips? Kill you, Kevin. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh, winner, winner, Mikey Dinner. Yeah. Hold on, let's go back. The least. What this? It looks like a stain. It looks like somebody spilt a a, a dip cup <laughs> on his face, and there's like dip stain over here. It's not hair. Well, I, it's I, like here a mark. Here, I think he. I think he didn't shave. I, that's. No, dude, like oh. right he, on his left. His left, right. There's. It looks like a stain. It doesn't look like hair. Yeah, but it's it looks like the, the state of too. Vermont. Yeah, there, <laughs> yeah. right. But on the other yeah. side, he's got something, too, in the, basically the same place. The other side looks like hair, though. That looks like somebody oh. spilled soda on a carpet. Wow. I don't know. You could do is text me back, thanks. <laughs> Would that Watch kill this. you, Kevin? Oh, oh, we got to Would that kill you, Kevin? Oh, yeah. oh come on. Oh, I mean, ah. I dribbled. Emergency episode. Uh -oh. I burped. Oh, <laughs> double emergency show. Take your oh, pants, John. Man. We'll do two shows. Double emergency episode. Oh, God. I'm on double secret probation. Probation, John. Probation. It's not probation. I'm not going to put that one down. And then, Kevin, you got to lose Stevie Lou. I love Stevie Lou, and you love Stevie <laughs> Lou. Dude. <laughs> I mean, oh, hold on. Oh, well, well I'll get to uh, that. Back to you, shit, uh, Felicia. <laughs> Fleshla, Fleshla, whatever your name is. Secondly, <laughs> <laughs> that's badass who made that that was who can forget this that's fucking Amazing. put that back up that was great uh, i took it out already because i was uh, gonna put his next one up this one <laughs> <laughs> that's fucking great uh thank oh. you so there's strike one kept today oh and i'm gonna give you one band finger Ben Finger. Thank you. Hey. Strike two. I mean two. <laughs> One and a half. <laughs> I didn't do my show yesterday to stick it to you. Sticking it to me. <laughs> I can't stand Fatty Patty. And believe me, I might be going to Vegas, but only for one reason and one reason only. All you can eat. <laughs> Yeah. When they're out there for Hackamania. Maybe I'll go a little earlier. Maybe go a little later. But it's for hey, one. Hey, you won't know when I'm in Vegas. <laughs> maybe maybe Mel will be there. Maybe you won't. That's my that's a, that's my surprise. There it you might, go. It might be tomorrow. I don't know. I mean, I'm like the earthquake. Today or 50 years from now. You don't know. <laughs> but one day, I'll be there. Reason only. <laughs> that's all I'm going to say. Oh. We're sp okay, let's oh. guess what that reason is. But I wasn't trying to stick it to you, Kev. Stick it! Not at all. <laughs> I had a doctor's appointment at 11 for this bent finger. It's nice to have a and fan. I had Dude, he's singing. He's not singing your song. He's singing the uh, Beatles one. Uh, isn't it a Beatles song? Ba, ba, ba. It's not the... You did James Bond. Right. He's doing he I think he's doing the beat tripper. Movie. No. 
No. What, what's the song that I'm thinking of? Oh, oh, oh by uh, Paul McCartney. Uh, Paul McCartney. There yeah, you yeah, go. Yeah. There you go. Mm -hmm. I Jet by Wings. Right. At a stress test at three. So I got home at 1230 and went live from 1230 to 230 or two o'clock, whatever. it was, Because <laughs> I had to fucking take a shit. No. That's, but I weren't trying to stick it to you, Kev. Don't lump me in with these losers like the he's shit so, way. He's so afraid. I don't mm -hmm. stick it to you. I'm actually an ally. But I really love you. All the other whores are liars. <laughs> Too stupid to understand that. I sing you praises. High oh, praises. Well, that's a, that's an insult if you sing anything to anybody. Oh, God, I sing you praises. Oof. So you don't want to fuck with me. <laughs> Trust me. Hmm. Now we get to number three. Oh, shit. Three. <laughs> Good, John. Kev. You got to get rid of Stevie Lowe. Just his, the sound of his voice. And he comes in too hot. He's fucking, he's over modulating. He doesn't have proper modulation. Ugh. And this guy doesn't even have a microphone or headphones. He fucking has, he brings nothing to the table. You get nothing. Good day, sir. No. Ouch. Jesus. Fuck. You have to get rid of Stevie Lou. And he even had the audacity today. Anybody who watched KB today, Stevie Lou actually said, we are doing a good show today. We. Wow. Kev, oh. Oh. you got to fucking cut this guy loose. Oh, it was he's part saying, of the show, John. He's, what we we we? He said, we? "Are you sure, John? We what? You imagine what? anybody giving a fuck about Stevie Lou filling in for this one and that one and oh yeah, yeah, as if he is playing a part in it. You do an hour and a half rant. He comes in." Stumbling and stoned, and he's taking credit for your work. That's cut him loose. Gig. Let's call Adam. Call this show. Cut him. Cut him loose. Thank you. But anyway, who's played by that hottie? I can't remember her name right now. Yeah. It wasn't Madeline Kahn, but <laughs> it was like it was similar to her. <laughs> she had a cunt. <laughs> Maybe it was Wrath of Khan. Yeah, I'm thinking yeah. of. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, it was Madeline Albright. <laughs> <laughs> was it Valerie Perrine? Could have been. But, Who's he um, talking about? Anyway. <laughs> no idea. Right, what, what movie do you know, Frog? Yeah. Do you know, Frog, what movie he was talking about? One of the Superman movies. Yeah, I Valerie think. Perrine. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. And then Stevie Lou comes on. He's like, uh, yeah. Uh, I was like, he goes, oh, I just lost my thought. Yeah, because you are fucking stoned. You're reading the chats. You're not focused. <laughs> you suck, Steve. Uh, buh, 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 you're a user. Now you're asking Kevin for a computer? This guy got up to wash dishes during one of his shows. I mean, <laughs> it, this guy <laughs> lecturing anyone on not putting together a professional show is bananas. You're actually trying to shake Kevin down? But truly, really, a producer smoking pot during the show is horrible. Terrible. I've been saying it for years. But nobody hears me. It's because I'm high and I'm muted. I didn't realize. So, you for know. For a Mac? A vicious cycle. <laughs> Are you fucking with me? No. No. You gotta be fucking with me, Stevie. So, stop it. Kev, cut him loose. I'm sure he'll I, listen to you, John. The Duke has spoken. You got to turn him loose. I'm giving you my professional advice. No offense, Kev, but I've had way, much more experience 
in broadcasting than you Ouch. have. Ouch. Wow. And I'm, and I'm saying this to help you, but you got to cut him loose. He's dead weight. And you're paying him, you're an idiot. I'm just telling you. No, you're right. He's a scumbag. He'll stab you in the back. And now he's going to shake you down wow. for a laptop? <laughs> sounds like somebody's a little jealous. He wasn't asked to be the new Adam. That's what mm -hmm. it sounds like to me. Right. Fuck him. <laughs> I love Why this. do you care, John? Why do you care? Let him do his show. Texas Law Dog says, so basically Stevie has all yeah. of the same broadcasting qualities as John. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. Well, like the fact that, you know, this guy's show is terrible and he'll sit there and he'll go, I like it that way. I don't right. want it running uh, smoothly. I don't want to know where clips are, timestamps, have clips already pulled and set aside. Nope. I'd rather sit there and scroll while my show is live mm -hmm. day and night. Nope. Killogic has a good point. He says, how many times did Howard uh, uh, get told the same thing about Howard tell the, told the same thing about Stuttering John? So he's kind of painted uh, forward. What do Howard you mean? Said, oh, Howard oh, said it about yeah. John. Now yes. John's saying about Stevie Lou. Yeah. Yeah, look, let's check in real quick, see what these broads are up to. They're having a hell of a night over there. Let's see. Oh, there you go. <laughs> More <laughs> wine. <laughs> Boy, she's gonna get. He's gonna get some anal tonight. She's mm -hmm. drinking a lot. Oh, it's a lot of okay. wine for a gerbil. <laughs> <laughs> shout out, uh, Dabble Don Dada. Shout out to Zen on PDP. He killed it. Zen was cracking me up, dude. I was, I had one uh, AirPod in. I was with the family and uh, listening to Zen on there, uh, checking in. He was great, absolutely, and. Um, God damn it. Uh, why am I blanking on, on the radio guy? His Drew name. Lane. Drew Lane. Thank you. Drew was fantastic. It was his first uh, point dabble point, and he was great. And uh, Andy, always great. Carl, always great. It was, it was fantastic, uh, PDP, today. Over at uh, WATP, if you missed it, go check it out, mm -hmm. folks. Uh, and member up and support those people over there. Why not? Thank you, Dabble. Dabble Don. Hey, LOS, uh, uh, I channel Lil Jimmy Norton in saying it's the depth of the well of stupidity that's astounding. <laughs> Keep up the good work, boys. Thank you, LOS. The great quote. Uh, what are the two spots above? Yeah, so we were talking about that. One is clearly looks like a bad mustache he's trying to grow in where it's spotty. And then the other side looks like some sort of stain, some sort I think of, it's, I think it's still hair, but maybe he was eating or drinking something that stuck to the hair. So it's darker. Maybe resin. I don't know. Come on guys. You made a lot of, Oh yeah, we read this one. Anyway, Thank you, my dear. Uh, uh, Canarin Moreau. Behind my paywall. Thank you very much. Why can't Appreciate you have an easy you. name like Felicia? <laughs> I want you to dabble. <laughs> Thank you, Granny Banger. <laughs> that's the new. That's the new campaign. Put. We got Somebody's got to Photoshop that. Make him Uncle Sam with that finger. <laughs> Kyle, you guys, blind my Carl Card of Tukey. I'm going to get uh, ear cancer from wandering around the house with my Bluetooth <laughs> earbuds in. Big thanks. I remember Kumia saying to find you first episode to now. Congrats, Skull. Thank you, Thank Kyle. You. Thank you, Appreciate God. it. Speaking of Anthony, pick up his book, Spare Me. Mm -hmm. uh, check out wherever books are sold. I Bam! think it's still pre-orderable. I don't know if it's out out yet, uh, but either way, get involved. Uh, Dang Lizard, wait. Stuttering John claims he taught KB how to read Super <laughs> Chat. Of course. I believe it. I believe Not that he did. I just believe he's claiming that. Uh, mouth from sucking quarters out of parking meters. There you go. That's an option. Thank you, laziest man on Mars. Gardner fan, he's using mic songs. You guys together in a work? No, he's doing the, he's, believe me, he knows of Mike's song. He's heard it. Oh, yeah. Everybody's heard it. It's a fucking, it's, a, it's, it's the banger of all bangers. The OG. Bent finger. 
it points east when John is pointing west. <laughs> what a fucking mess. Uh, yeah. Such an odd finger. Half is straight and half just fucking hangs. Looks like a boomerang. <laughs> That's me laughing. <laughs> I always love that laugh. That's me laughing. Thank you. Wait a minute. Quick. We just what? got this in. The breaking news. Breaking news. What do you got? Mary Shalupa, everybody. You can't unsee that. You really can't. <laughs> you really can't. Thank you. Huh? Oh, goody. My Illudium Q36 Explosive Space Modulator. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the Looney Tunes critic for putting oh. that gem together. Thank you. Go support him on YouTube and in life. He's a good Buzzard. dude. Uh, Stuttering John going to Vegas weekend before to call them cowards. There you go. That's the plan. That's what a real man does. Hey, Rex Kramer. Little known fact. Stuttering John was originally cast as Benny the cab driver on Total Recall, but that <laughs> finger was just too alien-like. <laughs> I believe it. KB should pay Stuttering John and tell Stevie Lou to get it from him. Mm. Oh, that'd be great. Be great. Uh, Brian K, can you guys please start mimicking the claw hand when it we hurts. drink? It hurts. To or do when that. we when we when he pinches when he's doing this. Yeah, it hurts. I'll start doing it. Yeah, I don't care. I'll mimic anything you goddamn want me to when it comes to him. <laughs> Didn't Stevie Lou pay his karmic uh, department by getting dead, beat up? Dead. Or his debt, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And the guy was arrested and released. So, mm. might happen again. Watch out. Chris Angler, member for eight months. I was in a Zoom meeting today at work with a sales director, and he inadvertently made <laughs> balloons appear, counting on his hand, and I almost <laughs> lost my shit. <laughs> He gave you a double thumbs up and yeah. the balloon and the oh uh, just uh, what was it the peace sign peace and the sign, balloons yeah. come up yeah Eugene every time he refers to himself as the Duke all I can think of is the WWF jobber the Duke of Dorchester Pete Doherty who had better teeth <laughs> than Stuttering John what a pull yeah Being listen guys sniped. don't uh -oh. start super chatting us because you know uh -oh. how much that drives Vince and John oh, crazy. No. Don't Turn on Don't the it, super guys. chat machine or the oh. gifted memberships machine. Uh -oh. Gifted membership machine. Super chat just, machine. Just saw Mike from Red Bars reporting on you right now. Claims he's showing your leaked text. Weird feed mm. stuff and other sick <laughs> behavior. Hope it's not true. God, I hope not. Is Fuck. there any non-weird feed stuff? No, not yeah. really. Uh, Weasel Tales, no plug, just love. Thanks for the hype. Wrestling show soon. Weasel Tales, ladies and gentlemen, mm. uh, go support him over there on YouTube as well. Uh, member for nine months, my man Chalino. Let's go. You, Thank you dumb buddy. fuck. And in, in a rut, gifted one. Mm. Let's uh, gifted five. Why the Excuse, of me. Me. Excuse me. I read that fake wrong. Uh, Looney Tunes critic, Frog, say this. Go ahead. Frog. Frog, who's peeing? Oh, oh could you peeing? not hear me? Damn it! No, I was from here. <laughs> Damn it! Someday we'll find it. The rainbow connection, the lovers, the dreamers, and me. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> Way to sell it. Yeah. Hey, pulp girl, gifted Ooh, five. Whoa. She's fake. That cat's dead. Thanks. It's not even alive. Uh, Granny banger. That mm -hmm. that's an idiot. Look Man, at his face much. and the finger. You can tell that's a moron. He that's not real. Yeah. Uh oh! Bet you shut it off, John. Fake super chat overlay not found. Error. FSJ. Chris Angler. Thank you, Chris. <laughs> He's fake. 
first fa- uh, fake first and last name. Uh oh, Louis Zamora, gift in five. Almost always sober. That's fake, John. Mm-hmm. Anytime you want to turn it off, go ahead. I know you got to run away. It's what you do best. Hey, Eugene. What? Wow, fifty Bam. bucks, stuttering John. You ag- ignored my question. Fuck you. <laughs> this guy would give you fifty bucks if you yeah. answered his questions. Or, wait, are, or blew your nose. Yeah, do something. And how come you were never taught to blow your nose? Mule! This guy's a god, John. Been screaming about stuttering John's upper lip, Vincent Price lip. <laughs> Vincent Price lip! <laughs> Vincent Price lip! Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, look at that fucking tan, you know motherfucker. <laughs> 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 Like, you can't unsee that. Hey, release the bots. Hellraiser Woo-hoo. 69. He's fake as well. Wow. Eclipse Melendez, John's grandson. Okay. Hi, Grandpa. I'll never meet you because mom, dad, and dad, mom hate you. All right. Thank you. I don't even know what any of that meant. Bounce the cat. Thanks for the laughs, guys. If you're ever feeling blue, hit me up. I owe you a few. That's Bounce the Cat. That's a fucking legend right there. And fake. Congrats on 18K. None of them are real, but thank Damn. you. Thank you. 18,000. Uh, trips, the petty bitch. Ladies and gentlemen, gift in one. Now I'm sideways. Remember that, Johnny? Remember you built your fans out of that money too, like the cancer mm-hmm. charity? Uh, another fake, the real mm-hmm. John Doe. I think that's a real name though, isn't it? I don't know. Sounds real. Thank you. All fake. Uh, Oh, look at this. Vince the Lawyer and Stuttering John doing standing 69s. Hey, it's blue and it's $2. Must be Vince. Uh Uh-oh. Hey, dang lizard with five bucks. John, you told us he didn't pay child support during the legal dispute. So Stuttering John didn't pay during that time without being directly arrested? Interesting question, dang. Hmm. Hmm. Explain Vince the lawyer's call to Casey's ex. Did he disclose he was recording? Uh, Mm -hmm. He did not. Hmm. He did not. And you know what, Don? It's an interesting point because let's say hypothetically the woman that he called and recorded without her knowledge was in Florida. And Vince Hmm. is calling from New York State. Hypothetically, wouldn't Vince be in trouble just like uh, 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 Carl and, and Moonhead are in trouble? Yes. Carla and Moonhead, thank you. I rest my case. High school dropout. Out! Thank you. <laughs> thank you, uh, Donna. I think the spots are there because he has the resolution on his cam turned back to 1998 technology <laughs> to hide the fug. My man is pixely. You're right, Fugly. You're right. Ah, best chat ever. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Vegas dog. Thank you, pal. I appreciate it. All right, let's get back to stupid. Oh, thank you, RDC Anthony. I appreciate the 10 bucks, my friend. Thank you. John, you still watching or are you crying? Can you even see through the tears? Let's go. <clears throat> nah. Nah, Stevie. You ain't getting, you get nothing. <sighs> you get nothing. Good day, sir. Yeah, I told you he stopped watching. He ain't sniping anymore. He can't hang. He can't even watch. Even if he wanted to snipe, he doesn't have the guts or the backbone to do it. That is true. You gotta fucking cut them loose. All right. I'm gonna give you some really bad news. Uh oh. And um, I know a lot of you All right. are gonna be saddened by this. Here comes a bad I can bit. understand. It's deservedly so. <sighs> Throw it. Throw it. Throw. Yeah. Wild pitch. Oh, get it. <laughs> that one goes yeah. into the seat. Got it. <laughs> ah. Missed it by a fucking lot. <laughs> Missed it by a lot. It, by it is lot. It is about 10 <laughs> feet away from him. How the fuck do you miss a garbage can five, <laughs> 10 feet away from you? He's the anti-Michael Jordan. Do you think the lights go off in his house if these two fingers don't connect? <laughs> Do you think there's some sort of electrical surge that he has to hold the whole time? Ah, uh, uh, they stopped. They'd want to see the job. Oh, that's a shame. Poor darlings. Merry Christmas, T head. You sloppy that's drunk. My, 
Come on. You can't unsee that. <sighs> oh my god this, he dragged it out for this uh, long i have a perfect heart <laughs> yeah baby <laughs> you want you wanted to get a second opinion on that uh on that finger on maybe finger. you want to get a second opinion on that heart yeah two stroke mcgee over here says yeah. i have a perfect heart oh that's gonna piss you off but I'm fine. My ticket be good. Yeah. My liver looks like That's a piece right. of gum. I did the treadmill. Uh -oh. Are we zooming? And I oh, no. was oh, no. perfect. Doctor, and he's a good doctor, good cardiologist, said, John, your heart is perfect. All right, all right. No, no, Stop fucking, this. yeah. Who oh, does this sound like? again? I hate to bring it back to that. Go but ahead. It, it's, it's, it's I, him. I aced it. it. I'm perfect. It's uh, no doctor would say that. That I mean, you're just begging to be sued. You're begging to be oh. sued by telling a patient something is perfect, or even if it was perfect, they right. wouldn't tell you it's perfect. Also, yeah. did they tell you that moment? No, no, no. It takes, uh, you, you know, usually a day. To get the result, <laughs> please get that Bob Euchre drop just <laughs> a bit outside. That was the other thing I thought about getting. <laughs> you should. <laughs> School. Well, that'll keep your heart healthy. Hold on, hold on. Where is it at, Jim? Uh, no cardiologist will tell you your heart is perfect. I had a triple bypass in 2017. My first heart attack when I was 37. I'm 61. I had a stent put in when I was 37. He's a fucking liar. Of course. There you go. There you go. You passed the stress test. Congratulations, you fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> now that I believe the doctor saying, but perfect? No. Yeah, doctor would never say that. No, especially Those he's had he's had a couple strokes. Uh, you know, he's not in great health, you know. No, that. and the, the, uh, even this they wouldn't say 99%. Right. They but, but I I listen. They would definitely wouldn't say perfect. Right. Say so your heart is fine. Your heart's doing well. There's no problems. <laughs> he survived it. <laughs> <laughs> no pocky fucking heart here. No pocky. Maybe because I lived a good life. You know. Didn't hate blacks. Didn't hate what? Uh, Jewish people like pocky. Just chased him around oh, with fire no. crackers. All right, what do we got? Um, all right. All right, I'll go for uh sneeze this time. I was gonna take sneeze too. All right, no, I'm I'll take uh, I'll take uh I'll take sn snot. All right. I'll take stutter. Both, I'll both take stutter. Be right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know. Who cares? Let's just yeah. enjoy it. Consider all people equal. <laughs> Except women. Hold on. Oh, oh, I had it. Oh, 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 oh we were both right. Oh, oh, no homophobia, no trans hate. It's all love, peace, and harmony in the millennium. Oh, we're oh just going to keep talking like, like a fucking alien face hugger didn't just fly out of your goddamn mouth. What in the... What? Oh, oh, that was a great <laughs> shot. Hold on. <laughs> 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 That's what he looked like if he ever came again. Uh, uh, oh, oh. <laughs> it looks like a crash <laughs> test dummy. We're leaving Earth's atmosphere. <laughs> <laughs> no, the airlock isn't sealed. Don't open the door. <laughs> uh, oh. Back to back, too. There was no. Yeah. Oh. oh. Oh, oh, no, it was my. it was snot and spit and sneeze trifecta, baby. Wow, the holy grail. Oh. Equal. Hold on. <laughs> oh god. You know, <laughs> there's no homophobia. <laughs> good night, everybody. Oh god. <laughs> Emergency <laughs> toe.
Uh, uh, Please eat snothead. Sp- Please uh, eat spaghetti. Uh, <laughs> snothead, motherfucker. Oh, it must have really pissed John off. He signed off. Show's over. Ah, oh, Johnny. Oh, we didn't mean to upset you. Wahapa. Wahapa. Oh, goody. My Illudium Q36 Explosive Space Modulator. <laughs> Uh, are we having fun or what? Hit like, hit subscribe, 1100 plus in here. Uh, you know, notify and uh, member up if you don't want to get in with your own money. Maybe somebody will gift you one. Turn on accept gift and memberships. Link is in the description. Thank you for joining us. Let's go. <laughs> Not now, clown. Be a no trans hate. So love, peace, and harmony oh in the Melendez. That was brutal. Abode. Mm. Oh, oh. Everything oh. is perfect. <laughs> I'm living fine. And now that my heart's okay, I don't yeah, got to go no on my shit. walk. Two girls, one cop wasn't as jarring as that double sneeze. That was brutal. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, SG, he, he wiped it all on his couch. Well, oh. mo- some of that flu definitely hit the couch. The other one, who knows what it hit. Yeah, yeah that, that had some velocity on it. Yeah. That made the garbage can. That, you're right. <laughs> that second one, uh, hot heat, as they like, uh, uh, like to call it in the majors. Oh. Yeah, we should get the, uh, when they do the... Uh, Velocity, what is it? The uh, velocity of the ball getting hit out, <laughs> yeah, <it>. yeah, the, <laughs> like the fox track or whatever, yeah. when it tracks the ball. Somebody posted a funny picture and had me walking, you know, while OJ was being chased. I love, see, you know what, John? I don't find double murder funny. Yeah. Thank you. That's a difference between me and the shit wave and mm-hmm. every all these other assholes in the dabble verse. I could take a joke. <laughs> wow, what a great description, PFG. This has turned from watching a man lie to everybody else to a man who is really lying to himself. Mm-hmm. Wow. Perfect. Yep. Wait, he's not talking about us, is he? What? Okay, just making sure. I don't know. It's tricky these days. Yeah. It could mean us. <laughs> I'm fine with you guys goofing on me. Hey, you know what? I have a theory. Broccoli hasn't been around lately. I'm guessing it has Uh-oh. everything to do with the date. <laughs> Brock, you know I love you, but it's tax day coming up. <laughs> You're probably like, holy shit. <laughs> oh, so he's he's wait a minute. Oh, so he's saying he doesn't have money to give him because of taxes, or is he saying that that's his job and he's busy doing that? I'm trying to figure out if he's doxing him or or mocking him. Probably My both. guess is Broccoli's self-employed, so he's going to owe taxes, you know? Gotcha. Right. I got I to cut that on these super chats. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> but, uh, it's <laughs> fucking. The guy who just announced everything's perfect got winded ch- drinking beer. <laughs> uh. But, you know, I mean, this is what I'm talking about. Um, uh, 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 dude. It's time to play <laughs> Mox or Dox. That's right, everybody. <laughs> What's he going to do? do, 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 do. Uh, he's uh, Mox. And then Stevie Lou comes on. He's like, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, this was his critique. Let me turn up the volume here. <laughs> This is what he um, this is what he yelled at Stevie Lou about doing on MLC. He's doing on his show by himself. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, let's see. Let's see. Hmm, which one is this? Let me see. I got to oh, find the one I'm looking for. I'll see. I hate no. let's see. Uh, 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 um, uh, and then Stevie Lou comes on. He's like, uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, let's see. I'm still trying oh, to find no. this shit. Uh, so you know, oh, it, it, you know, I don't. Uh, the I don't fuck is he like talking it, about? It just isn't gonna, you know. What? Uh, what? Uh, uh, <laughs> okay. uh, Easy, real. 
uh, but let me find this. Uh, I, there's so much to play to you guys. Oh. Yeah, the, Fair enough. Uh, <laughs> mm-hmm. Let me see if this is it. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, yeah, man. Huh? Come on. That's not it. Uh, what do you mean it's hell. not it? Uh, I, I, I can't find it now. Oh, it doesn't my matter. God. I oh, thought it was yeah. when fucking I'm trying. I'm, tr- I'm trying to find it. What? You know, Silent so Mike fucking saying, "Oh fuck!" Can I want this clip so bad? I waste some time for a second. Oh, You've already finally. wasted time. Yeah. So much time. Well, I guess that didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, here we go. All right. This is it. Uh, All right. I, I, now so I found we go. Sorry, now guys. <laughs> so here we go. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Now, guys, I'm just telling you, look, this is just what they do. And mm-hmm. they're all hypocrites. All of us. Mm-hmm. Every single one of them. Off, yep. I mean, I mean, like, so hypocritical. And but you. I got my people. And my people keep feeding me stuff. Uh-oh. Mm-hmm. Hopefully they're feeding you strychnine. Uh, okay. <laughs> Fingers crossed for cyanide. All right, here we go. So this is the shit way. Huh? Now, I, I always like to read the title because I love that they pounce on this idiot. Mm-hmm. Revision mm-hmm. is shit way. I didn't trash stuttering John's kids. I just posted hateful tweets about them on my show and let my co-host produce the trash on my show. Not me. Well, you are still responsible, you dumb fuck. Mm. Uh, so here Come and get me, Johnny. Here we go. Pretend I never heard you yell, grab the <laughs> pork, Joyce. Yeah. Fine. Why does it stop? Okay, I don't give a <laughs> Fine. Fine. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Ow! Hold oh, well, on. We got uh, a little breaking news, a little surprise mm. here, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Uh, you know him. You love him. Uh, the man, the myth, the legend. He is, of course. We interrupt our regularly special program. Wait a minute. We just got this in. Breaking news. Breaking news. Your friend and mine, Carl, oh, in the whoa, building. The and you talked like a moron. I thought, Hello. I thought Zenhauser was here. I didn't know <laughs> that was host of the Thanks, town guys. now. Wow. That, that Zen, uh, everybody's ranting and raving yeah. about him now. What oh. an appearance today. Fantastic today on Point Dabble Point. He was doing his impression of Silent Mike, and it was, hey, and <laughs> and uh, what you call it, uh, uh, Drew was great too. I thought yeah. Drew and Zen were both very good today. I was so excited to have Drew Lane on Point Dabble Point today because Drew Lane is a morning radio legend. If people don't right. know, he was the number one guy in Detroit for decades, and he has gotten so into the Dabbleverse. Him and I have text threads that go on for days about stuttering john and it's all he wants to talk about sometimes but it's difficult to lock him down and get him to come on a show and do stuff he's very busy he's, he does his own thing so it's so exciting to have him on there talking about stuttering john for two hours today not to mention he's a real radio guy so this is a little like insulting to a guy you know <laughs> like to talk and deal with this stupid shit but I wanted to, I want, I almost texted you this during PDP, uh, but I wanted to bring this up to you because uh, I brought this up the other day. He's been doing a lot of talk about this private eye dust. Oh, yeah, 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 right. Now, here's my theory. We didn't bring that up on PDP today. That's my bad. Well, here's my theory about this. There is no private eye named Dustin. The person he's getting this information from is a person that we all know. Okay. And what John is trying to do, because when has John ever truly doxed someone that's helping him, that, mm-hmm. that he's gone out of his way to out them? So why does he keep using this name, Dustin? Because in his lies, he exposes the truth, right? Okay. Always. So he's using this Dustin name because it's somebody we all know. So it's a cover. There is no Dustin. He says the guy lives in New Jersey. He wouldn't say these things if they were true about the guy that's getting all this dirt for mm-hmm. his, uh, on his uh, enemies for him. Uh, what are your thoughts on that? Oh, 
I don't think he ever has a PI work at anything. He's said this multiple times. If you go back a year or two ago, he was getting all this information through IP addresses. Mm -hmm. And he's like, you guys don't even know. I know what state you're in. I, I might even say the state later, you know? <laughs> so he's always threatening things that would intimidate him. Um, but as far as Dustin being someone we know, is it someone you and I are on text threads with? No, I don't oh, think it's somebody okay. that close. I think it's somebody from the Dabbleverse that's very vocal in the Dabbleverse, but he's trying to protect that person. Uh, somebody in the real estate field, I feel, because a lot of the information he's giving is real estate related, hmm, if you notice. Okay. How much Carl owes on his house. Oh, you know? by the way, he's way off on that. So. Yeah, of course. <laughs> so stupid. Yeah. That's the last point in all of this yeah. is, all of this information has been wrong right. for the most part. So it's fun watching. Don't get but me wrong. Imagine if he was correct about it. So I can't remember the number right. he threw out, but he's like. 45 Carl, grand. 45 grand he said you owe on your I house. owe on this house I live in in Rochester, right? Correct. I mm. wish. That'd be great. <laughs> that's why I was like, I was jealous when yeah. I heard it. I go, fuck, that's awesome. I, I bought it 11 years ago. That'd be insane. But I, okay. But imagine if he threw out a number that was correct. I can't imagine being intimidated by that. Like, oh, no. <laughs> well, oh, how, God forbid he would know something like that. Like, who gives a shit? Why would that well, matter? He gives a shit. And if you were to find out what he owed on property, he would he would be upset. He would lose his shit over it. It would affect him. It doesn't affect anybody else right. that they try to, you know, uh, uh, ambush with this well, stuff. Well, I, I played a clip on Point Dabble Point today. Where and you and you guys maybe have played it on here. I know you're doing his Thursday night stream when he got really drunk tonight. Yeah, right? yeah. You're doing mm -hmm. this stuff. Oh yeah. So, yeah. so he was seven or eight beers in, and he he gave me a real good warning. He uh, goes, "Oh, ooh. watch out!" He goes, "You're p playing with the big boys now, oh. and uh, just wait until what I have in store for you." And I've been goofing on John for six years. Now. Why? Why are we? Why is he waiting if he had yeah. anything? Right? Yeah, like all of a sudden now he's gonna take the gloves off. Like this should have happened years ago, John. I'm Carl, not you, intimidated in any way. You remember when he came back after his eight month break, and yeah. what was his whole opening statement was? Wait till you see what I have on these guys. Mm -hmm. I have I stuff do. on Bob, on yep. Shuli, on yep. Car, on Mike. You can't even believe. The bombshells. And he's like, and just wait till I come back. And then he comes back and just like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> the other, uh, the other thing I wanted to bring up to you was the fact that, uh, I probably can no longer enter Las Vegas because he's uncovered, uh, that I worked illegally as a blackjack dealer almost 30 years ago <laughs> without a high school diploma. Which I'm pretty sure wasn't a requirement when I got hired for the job. They Ima imagine if it was. Who could possibly <laughs> give a fuck? There's play right, but there's people that don't even speak English. They just know numbers and, and know. they work there. Like the view should go up a lot more since Carl is here. Uh, That's right. Yeah. I do. I do buy views, so I'll, I'll work <laughs> on right. that. Don't worry right. about it. But Im imagine if you were the one folding the towels on a cruise ship and making those giraffes and shit. And he's like, this guy doesn't even have his high school diploma. He's making giraffes. I am going to let Carnival know about this. Yeah, this, yeah. this is what's so nuts because John, as you guys know, for two weeks now, has been talking about me and Vinnie Paulino going to prison for a phone right. call to a restaurant. Right. And so in John's mind, like there's, there's no level of tattling that won't lead to, to people's lives being ruined. Correct. Right. There's no <laughs> statute of limitations on whatever it is that thing is and how, unless it has to do with him. Then well, wait, like, that's what I was going to say. This is what's so incredible is that as soon as he started saying like Vinny called CB tomatoes and didn't say that they were on the air, uh, on the creep off and therefore we're going to go to prison for five years. And people are just like, Hey, remember when you played that call with Donald Trump and you pretended to be a Senator and then you put it on the internet, like that would be way more illegal for multiple reasons. Right? Mm -hmm. Well, how about this? And, and uh, I don't know for sure, but I think I remember didn't him, uh, didn't, didn't John call the Stern show back office when him and Royce were doing podcasts. Oh didn't, yeah. Didn't, yeah. For sure. Yeah. Okay. So he's calling from California two party. 
consent. Mm. Well, <laughs> he's calling to New York, and then they put it on the podcast. Let's go after him, too. Let's it's, put him in California. It was a prison. different time. No, it wasn't, John. Oh, that, that was his thing, too, when people called him for that. He was like, that was six years ago. <laughs> Trump's team has a lot more to worry about than that. You know, he's always got <laughs> this weird excuse for uh, why whatever he does is, is not in the wrong. <laughs> it's insane amazing amazing so yeah oh but that was the other thing too back when he was doing the show with royce i remember the first time i reviewed his show and we were playing clips from his show and he goes on and he goes royce they can't play clips from my show that's illegal i'm gonna go after them and royce goes "Ah, i wouldn't worry about that john we we play clips from howard stern he goes no but that's because they're talking about me (laughs) he always has this this weird (laughs) loophole in his mind just like okay so if they were talking about you you could play the clip what? It's amazing. This logic is something so else, stupid. man. Uh, the wine is grape juice, and this is so fake. Thank you, Seven Large mm. Army. Yeah, we were watching <laughs> Vince with his prop giant wine glass. It's actually regular size, but it really does look like a prop. Julie, you dang son of Noga, son of a Noga. Mike, you silent son of a bitch. Fake, by the way. Thank you, Lewis. Appreciate it. Yeah, John checked in to snipe for a little bit. People started super chatting, and he checked right out. He he left and shut down his show. I think he so. super chatted Point Dabble Point today. I saw a $2 uh, thing from mm-hmm. him t- making fun of our show. I don't $2 know dollars sounds not. like him. Yeah. $2 sounds it's like him. either him or Vince the lawyer. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's get back to this package. Too Thanks for joining us, Carl. Yes, guys. Yeah. Oh, anything you want to plug real quick? We got uh, 1,200 plus in here. Oh, yeah, for sure. Uh, Hackamania.com. We're going to be out in Vegas doing a live show. And uh, it's a whole weekend. We have comedy shows. We have live podcasts. Hackamania.com. Promo code WATP. (laughs) WATP. Promo code 20% off. Be careful. Uh, He's going to be there either before or during or after or not at all. (laughs) Did you hear that threat? Yeah. No. Really? What did he say now? Because I know he's talking about going goes, I might be there before. He goes, I'm coming to Vegas. He goes, uh, uh, it might be before, might be after, but I'm coming. Don't you worry. I'll be there. Well, I, it's almost I, like his Washington, D.C. trip. He's going to plan it when Melton's on vacation. <laughs> he's going to be like, God damn it, he's not here. John Melendez, you're on the guest list. All right? Ooh. You're on my guest list. Please come down. We want to see you there, buddy. Car Blanche. Mm-hmm. Uh, 18,000 Lachaim Caballeros. Thank yeah. you, brother. Yeah, we just hit 18,000 subscribers. Uh, Thor's Pinky, 18K in three years. Stuttering John has 20K after 10 years. Ouch. Don't tell him that. Yeah. He's not going to like that. But uh, that's not the clip I want. Fuck. And do you remember the three find, minutes any- of, uh, uh, oh, here yeah. it is? To yeah. just now say that's not the clip I wanted. That's not even the it. clip. So it took him three and a half minutes to find the wrong clip. Perfect. Exactly. But it's the one where. Uh, Pretend I never heard you yell, grab the. It could be. It's something where Silent Mike. It says, I think the title was, you know, Stuttering John is looking for Silent Mike's um, divorce. Uh, Do you hear how he says, help me out? He's always talking to someone who's not there. Right. Well, John, I, I pointed this out. I said, John's a lonely guy. He doesn't have a lot of friends. John mm-hmm. got very upset about that and started listing all of his friends that he has. Oh, yeah. That was is extra douchey. Well, extra it's incredible douchey. because most of his friends are from Long Island where he grew up. Who he, yeah. never, he doesn't see them at all. And then when he went to California, I think he listed three people. He's lived in California for 20 years. I think there were three people. I know, and then he even got to his brother-in-law and his nephew. He's listing all of his friends <laughs> and family members no. got included. Well, and then my my thing to this was like, I wish we could call those people and go, "Would you consider John a friend?" Oh. and hear their answer about yeah. it. You know, John John Melendez. Oh no, no, yeah, yeah. we went to school, high school together, right? Yeah. Is that I, fucking I, guy I, I still alive? Guy. Yeah, right. What? <laughs> Going after his divorce, the cry. Every day he has a reason to cry and Mason to do a show. But that's what he's really angry. They, they haven't done anything to me. And i dragging his family into this shit. I, it doesn't make me feel like a winner. It makes me kind of feel like him. Yeah, that's not it. 
<laughs> no, that's not listen it. to what he said. <laughs> no, that's I love when he plays clips, yeah, that make him look bad. Because I've right. done that a couple times on this, where he's playing clips where you're yeah. talking about, like, John, you're the one who's praising Muttering Jay, and he yeah. called your kids out, and he got you fired. Just like, that's not the clip. That's not it. <laughs> like, whoops. I mean, and I would love if more people on Truly's and Honors would just post you know, put the heading, whatever you want, put yeah. the title, whatever you want. You don't have to put porn in it. Just put the wrong clip in there of him getting <laughs> roasted. It would be hilarious. No, that's wait a minute. Uh, hey. Oh, be great. Ah, uh, Terps, come on, man. Oh, here it is. You got this. Okay. Now, okay. This is, this is it, but I don't know. Nope. That's not it either. I don't know what the fuck it is. Cause silent Mike makes that dumb comment. Uh, about, uh, oh, uh, you know, uh, John, are, are you not going to find any fucking divorce payments? Scroll. Uh, <laughs> wow. It doesn't matter. I mean, it doesn't matter. But I don't it care. was something it doesn't where. Doesn't matter. I just set it up for eight minutes. I just, but... Yeah, I just spent eight minutes scrolling around in the summer. It doesn't matter. I don't care. It's fine. <laughs> you know what? I changed my mind. Scroll. Let's move on. All right, yeah. I'm just going to ask a question, and we're all boomers yeah. here, obviously. Mm -hmm. You yeah. guys ever go to a, a web page, like on a Reddit page or something, sure. and you're like, oh, I want to reference this later on my show. You ever right. copy the URL and yeah. paste it into your notes so yeah. that then when you're talking about it at your show, you could be like, yeah. yeah, let's watch this video, and you just Boom. paste it into your browser and you watch right. it? Like, John, that's how stupid you are. This is the most basic internet usage thing you could possibly do. Yeah, it's it's literally I'm up till one in the morning most nights doing exactly that for the next <laughs> right. day. Like, you know, so on point devil point today, we played a ton of clips. We, we normally don't do that, but I'm trying not to play as much stuttering John who are these podcasts. So I've been watching the last couple of nights. I've just been writing down timestamps. I'm like, oh, that was dumb. And I write down the timestamp. So today I went on and I just scrolled to the timestamp, clipped it, put it in my list, you know. Didn't take very you hear much that, time. Joe? You hear that, Joe? <laughs> Sounds like somebody's tick tock, tick tock, buddy. But didn't take didn't take much time at all. But could you imagine if I an hour before the show today just went scrolling through his show like, yeah, he was talking about all his friends. Where where was that? Oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh. If it takes me five seconds to share the screen, these guys are up my ass. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. And it's like this guy gives you eight minutes of this back to back, you That's know. Insane. <laughs> and, and you know what? This is the hardest thing to clip and to show how bad John is at his job because yeah. it makes our shows bad when you watch him just flail around for yeah. seven minutes at a time. You're like, well, I can't. I got to speed it up or something. Right. It's hard to portray well, this. Frog does something that I did a couple times with Eric the Midget was I took all of the dead pauses out, like all the gaps and all the and just made it like – he could just talk normally and yeah. it was like 40 seconds, but <laughs> all that audio was seven minutes with the, all the uhs and the beeps and the blops and all this shit. Fucking wild. And real quick, I'm looking at the chat. I'm, I'm Gen X too, but we have to call ourselves boomers. It's yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's what we have to do. Silent Mike goes, well, John, are you not going to find any fucking, uh, any, uh, you know, child support, uh, well, I said it better issues yet. Yeah, he started yeah. the show by saying, Mike, uh, I never went to jail for missing uh, child support payments, which makes you a hypocrite because you know who did? Bob Levy. Whoa. What, what a magic trick that was. He's insane. <laughs> he took us on a journey there. I was like, I'm looking at Mike going, Mike was in the clink. Look at this. Well, had... and he's, he's trying to do guilty by association. Sure. But didn't John just sign up for being on the Bob and VTL show? According to John mm -hmm. and, and VTL, it's a go. Yeah. So apparently he's he's ready to work with Bob on that, but he can call out Mike for working with of Bob. And yeah, and okay. I and I know the rumor is that uh, I have I have uh, faxed over uh, his contract to Bob to remind him that he is under contract and is not <laughs> not the case. Bob can go and do whatever show he wants to do. Uh, so just want to clarify that nobody's being told not to do anything. Bob Levy got put in jail for not paying his child support. Uh-oh. 
So we were looking at his face, right? And his upper yeah. lip, he's got a stash on the right hand side, his right, mm. like stash pubes. But then on the left, it almost looks like he has a stain on his face in the same spot. It is symmetrical, though. Yeah. Give him that. Look. <laughs> look <at this> <laughs> <Yeah. thing. laughs> it's so, I mean, it's so weird. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah. Support. Uh oh. <laughs> He really is through. Uh, oh, yeah, I have that one. Yeah, don't worry. Uh, this guy says he's got he's got moon heads. All right. Okay, he's got moon heads. All right. So Vinny Pauline. Fantastic. Now I can't I can't verify this. So who knows if this is like real? This is one of his now that's Vinny Paulino, correct? That is him. And somebody's, you know, there he is with those beady eyes. Looks like a guinea pig. And then somebody said this is his school picture. Is that is that is that true? I I don't know. Is that true? That's hilarious, John. Is that <laughs> is that Vinny Paulino's? I don't know. It looks oh, like it is. No, oh, I don't know. That's a zinger. That's what somebody sent me. I have no idea. Good stuff, John. No <laughs> idea. Wow. What do I well, know? You know, it, if that's, I, I have no. You know, it could be. I guess. You know, wow. I just, I just googled a uh, man with Down syndrome with beard, and there's like a thousand <laughs> pictures. That looks all better, a all lot more better. like Vinny right. <laughs> than the kid right. from Life Goes On. Okay, uh, you know, John, John's got his followers. They they share the same yeah. work ethic as John. <laughs> School. There Skull. you go. That's where the uh, answers are. Uh, this is too much fun. Hey, I love you guys. I love being here. Yeah. And uh, you know, he got wasted. Uh, this was last night, and then tonight he's drinking, and he goes. I don't give a fuck. I'm getting loaded tonight. <laughs> <laughs> well, Friday, of course. Yeah. It's a hey, weekend. Yeah, what was last night? Wow. Uh, this is just fun for me. And you know he's still working at the school because he's commenting on Twitter about the traffic reporter. So oh, I didn't see oh, that. I mean, I'm yeah, blind, but... okay. the same thing. What's the word that she said? Looky lose. That he's doing. He did that tweet again. But all that does. See, this is the thing, John. The minute you open your mouth, you reveal everything. And you never you never understand that. So he's sitting there talking about the traffic reporter again. I go, well, why is he up so early listening to the traffic report? When I revealed the school district that he was working at, or the school he was working at, <coughs> at first he goes, oh, what is that? Is that a school? I, I'm not familiar. Fair, and then, fair, fair what? Yeah, uh, right, fair, whatever fair, it was. Fair. And then the next day he goes, Lady K thinks I'm, you know, father, and I have to go all the way over the hill to get there. Just like, oh, so you know exactly where it is. Okay, oh, that, look at that. that. It's a new day. That quick. You figured it out. It's a new day. <laughs> this is truly. Oh, wait, G Rob. It really looks like Starring John has a yeah. chocolate boost mustache. Yeah. Oh, Maybe wow. that's what it is. Yeah, like uh, a good time. Again, he's three. Like he, he, to, he needs somebody to come and wipe his <laughs> mouth for him after he drinks. And uh, but you know, I I hate to neglect. Like Kevin was neglecting his super chats all day. I wrote him two super chats. A, I said Kevin wasn't sticking it to you. I, I well, before we get into stupid here, uh, I do want to bring. I I don't watch MLC, so I didn't know. But apparently, a lot of regular. Uh, chatters are upset with Kevin because he was refusing to put up super chats yesterday. Do you know anything about that, Carl? Yeah, from what I've heard, and I don't know if this is true or not, I've been watching MLC either, but now he's got Stevie Lou producing the show and right. people are goofing on Stevie Lou's wife or whoever, and so he's not putting super chats up. Mm. So people are, are outraged that there's censorship now on MLC. Mm. Well, there you go. I did my show between two fucking doctor appointments. And the second one, I said, at least OJ doesn't have to hear Stevie Lou. And it took him, and of course he laughed, but it took so long oh. to fucking get to it. Oh. At least OJ doesn't have to hear Stevie Lou. Yeah. That was his joke. It's a comedy giant over here. Uh, Who else? 
but me has an eaten thigh bone right next to me while I broadcast. Oh, what the Homeless fuck? people. That's who. Yeah. Be more funny. <laughs> I suck at this. You're so uh, bad at comedy. Oh. Fair enough. <laughs> I'm authentic. I'm the genuine article. Uh, that's why you want me, white. Short Fridays. Your biker friends like you ratting. <laughs> ratting on who? I don't write. I don't rat on anybody. What? You don't know. What are you ta- uh, John, uh, he talking about? Uh, he called the RPD on me. He called the <laughs> FBI on Chad Sumac, according to him. That's he different. obviously he wants uh, Stevie Tomatoes to press charges and get me arrested and thrown in prison. What's he talking about? It's all he does is rat. <laughs> you dug up my illegal dealer history from yeah. 25 years ago. <laughs> right. <laughs> My God, it's your whole show. Any of their names. You don't know any of their addresses. <laughs> is this at the start? Yeah, it is. Okay. That was all. The- you don't know any of what he's talking about is biker friends. You don't know any of their names. You don't know any of their address. Wow, he got scared. Yeah. That was interesting, yeah. that response. Yeah. I, don't write, I don't rat on anybody. <laughs> you don't know any of their names. You don't know any of their addresses. <laughs> Is this at the start? Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, he's he's. Look at the fingers going. Yeah, yeah. Uh, dude. You've been noticing the digging, the digging it, the 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 pressing of the fucking thumbnail into. He's having the... fun, Julius. <laughs> he's an entertainer. It's what You're he does right. for fun. Yeah, right. Dude, the I thing forgot. that I've been picking up on, we talked about a lot on Point Devil Point, is um people he's people are really getting to him that he didn't play the guitar solos on his album. <laughs> oh yeah, I saw this. I'm going to do a deep dive on, on our Patreon, yes. patreon.com slash yeah. who are these podcasts, where I'm going to analyze the studio tracks and then watch him play the songs live and figure out if he's the one playing guitar on the studio tracks. Because I have a feeling he got a studio guy in there to record so. these songs. I think yeah, so. Yeah, I think if, so too. If you got room for Morse, I know his guitar playing makes Morse nuts. So, oh, uh, you Mike, know. yes, yes, you have an invitation. Thank Let's you. analyze this. Thank I want to break it down because when I was in Detroit, we did the live show in Detroit. I played his appearance on Conan playing his guitar solo on Gypsy Road or whatever the song is called. And I've never seen a guitarist do this before. He literally played his guitar solo in two different positions. Really? He, he played on. He played an A pentatonic scale on the fifth fret, mm-hmm. and then played the A pentatonic scale up on the seventeenth fret. Wow! Yeah, I know, okay. crazy. And that was all he did. And it was so <laughs> bad. It was terrible. <laughs> I've never seen a guitarist do this before right. on national television. So I called yeah. him out, and then people have been calling him out on his show. And they're like, "John, your solo on Conan wasn't very good." He's like, "My hair was long. It's a live uh, show. I, I swear to God, he's coming fault. with all these excuses." They filmed it wow. from the side. Uh, <laughs> That's great. Are you guys gonna have guitars and like do examples of what it should look like or what well, it would? I don't want to get too nerdy with it. That's but, the thing. But I'm can not gonna I just get... say yeah. you should and you should have mandolins. You guys should do it with mandolins. <laughs> really stick it to them. Really piss them off. That always <laughs> fascinates. The whole mandolin thing fascinates me because any mu- a a musician would say any other instrument you play is great. The more you play, yeah, the, right. The, the more impressive you are, the more, you know, obviously you love music. He was like, oh, look, look, it, 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 it doesn't have uh, six <laughs> strings. Oh. You know. Well, yeah. the, the whole mandolin thing, this is the funniest story because Vince, the loser was the one who made that video. He's right. the one who cut that video up of me going, Oh, watch my, off my mandolin. I had my mandolin sitting on the floor. He thought it was a star Wars toy, the Mandalorian. Ah, uh, so uh, Vince clipped that because he thought I had like Star Wars toys out that my wife was going to stand on. So then Kevin Brennan picks it up, just wants to make fun of me, doesn't know why, and just goes, Oh, what a loser. He's got a mandolin. And John goes, Kevin Brennan said it's uh, he's a loser for having a mandolin. Uh, so I'm on board. So right. all these people make fun of me for playing the mandolin. I have no idea why they're even goofing on me for playing a mandolin. <laughs> it's I the dumbest it. thing ever. They, it was funny. all because Vince is an idiot and thought it was a Star Wars toy. <laughs> Brilliant. I stumbled across Drew three months ago. Then Carl appeared on his show. Then Carl mentioned Shuli. And now here I am tangled in this web. <laughs> Damn that. you, Drew. Woo. Love it. Yeah, they got Thanks a big fan here. base, man, Drew and Mike. They, uh, they've they been around. Uh, right. Meredith Halfpenny. Mary Sesma's tea head, you sloppy drunk. Thank you, Meredith. 
Thank you. Randy. Your Honor, I have no further questions for Lady Kmart or Moonhead. Bring on the shit, will ya? Love that. How are all of the collars so fucked up? He, <laughs> I don't know. He does something with that's these getting collars. to him too. Did you see that the other day? We're just like, oh, what's going on with my collar? He's like oh, really? getting real self conscious about it now. It's funny. <laughs> Because then now it's sagging. It used to be up here. Yeah. I'm sure that's not the only thing that's sagging <laughs> yeah. these days. Uh, Stuttering John went to that weird Dr. Trump goes to. Yeah, that's yeah. the other thing is he announces his doctor told him his heart is perfect. perfect. When have you ever heard a cardiologist tell somebody they have a perfect anything? Any doctor tell you anything is perfect. You are fake news. <laughs> so I, I, I think that you'd be up for like a malpractice thing. Yes. Yeah. Because God forbid John suffers a heart attack or another mm -hmm. stroke or something, and this doctor wrote down perfect heart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like like yeah. doctors never tell you that. They they never. always think you could be doing better. Yeah. Of course. And John literally said on his show, he goes, I have a perfect heart. I don't have to walk anymore. Could you imagine Did you say a doctor? That? Yeah, I swear to God, I have the clip. Could you imagine a doctor going, Are you exercising regularly? Oh yeah, I am. Stop it. You don't have to. You're killing it. You you're kill that noise, yeah. dude. What yeah. are you talking that's, about? You're doing that's, fine. He makes it a donut. You're doing fine. That's hilarious because I was going to say half joking. Well, now now <laughs> that's why he's been walking and drinking the insurer for this last two months just for this appointment. But literally, yeah. that's why he's been doing it. Yes. For uh, real. Mr. Melendez, do you work out? Yeah. Well, from what I'm saying, you should stop. <laughs> you, are, you are in great shape, my friend. Can I tell you one more thing? Because I don't know if yeah. it made it in the package. I hope it did. But he also says that before his stress test, he had a monster energy drink. Yes. Oh, my God. What an idiot. He, he goes, because I, I, he was in between the um, appointment for his finger uh -huh. and the stress test. He was podcasting and he was drinking caffeine. He's like, I don't know if I should be doing this. John, no, you shouldn't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> They're checking your heart, retard. No. I'll be right in. I just got to do a big rail before I get on the treadmill. Be right there. Ryan. Uh, <laughs> saw Thanks. my cardiologist today. He said the same thing he always does. Lose some more weight. Couldn't hurt. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. The yeah there you go, Deadwood. Uh, hey, you non uh, Hey, you talentless hacks. Why am I the only troll you haven't blocked? The trailer trash producer has a thing for me. Also, where's the junkie? Uh, because Dom DeLuise is a national treasure. That's yeah, right. we're big fans of comedy, and uh, you got to specify because uh, I mean I'm here, so that's one junkie. Are you mm -hmm. talking about Bob? Uh, I didn't hate blacks, and I didn't hate Jews, says John. Also, John, poor <laughs> little Jew boy thought he was a good. There you go. Yeah. You know, point counterpoint. The John Melinda show. He literally was saying the reason why his heart is in such good shape is because he doesn't have hate in his heart. And I think he's misunderstanding what the heart actually does. God. <laughs> Unbelievable. Stuttering, uh, Rex Kramer, Stuttering John would run over his mother to have Kumia's life. Oh, that, I caught a clip today where uh, somebody sent him a super chat and they're like, Kumia is a million times funnier. He goes, no, he's not. No, he's not. He's not as quick as me. He's not as funny as me. The dumbest was he was watching Point Devil Point from last week when Missy B was on, and John goes, "Oh, look at this chick! You'd have to drink like a case." To <laughs> walk her. You're like, John, John, who are you fooling with this? this is so no, even better today is uh, Quad Father was there, and he goes, he asked him about Kumi, and, and he's like, "Yeah, he's funny. He's like the impressions are fucking killer." And John goes, "Impressions will only get you so far." He goes. <laughs> <laughs> It'll only get a serious <laughs> channel named after you. Uh, <laughs> toxic uh, anger, uh, sedentary lifestyle, poor diet, and chronic alcoholism sounds like the recipe for uh, heart health to me. Right. Yeah, yeah, Michael. And don't forget, every yeah. time he gets off the couch and comes back, he's out of breath. <laughs> every time. Anytime he moves, yeah. he's out of breath. He, we just watched him. Tell, he's, he's, his heart's perfect. Doctor said it, everything's great. He takes a sip and goes, uh, <laughs> the, the drinking is now exhausting. Uh, put the shot of John before he sneezes on the <laughs> violent display uh, of yes. uh, Pantera album right. cover. Yeah. I love that. Vulgar display of power. Thank yeah. you. Dick but Allen, what's that? Dick oh, I thought what, he said. what? What? 
Kevin? Big taste. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Magellan Gifton Five. Thank you, Magellan. And thank you, Eugene Gifton Five. The Julie nice. Network. Uh, all right, let's get back into this. I guess you guys have figured it out. Well, there's really not <laughs> it's a Tom. It just apparently when you guys write skull in your super chats, I end up having to drink. So you don't. You don't. I, I think you like me a little buzzed. It's the most transparent no. attempt to get people to send him super chats no, I've course. ever seen. Right. And it's not that they're saying skull because they they like that you drink. They're saying it because they want to see the dead hand come up when you drink <laughs> with the can. <laughs> that, I mean, who doesn't love that? Uh, John's uh, ready whip can. The best joke in his set was himself, Artie. <laughs> yeah, Artie's a comedian. We mm-hmm. all take shots at him, at each other. That's how it works. Yeah. Uh, he says, yeah. Uh, John's not funny, and I say, kill yourself. Exactly. We all take shots right. at each other. It's, it's <laughs> funny games. <laughs> Vincent Price hand. <laughs> Howard's a comedian. You think everything... See, all you idiots think everything that Howard said, you know... Like about us was real on the air. It's Whoa, not. Oh, we're the idiots. Wait. You're still mm-hmm. complaining about him telling you to abort your first kid. Mm-hmm. Not still only complaining that. about it. You wrote about it in this fucking book. <laughs> not only that, Carl, but he says he was great on the air because he was an open book. He talked about his real life. He didn't right. hide anything. So now, now we're the idiots for thinking that it's real. Oh, okay. Hmm. Got it. That's a stupid- I think what he's saying is that, like, when Howard was breaking his balls, that it was just in fun, like you guys right. do with me, you know? Yeah. Well, yeah. Wow. Now, shut up for the rest Howard of the Howard was in fun. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Howard, what's the quote that that guy, Generation XP, has? And he goes, Look at me, because you're not funny. Okay. You're not funny. And Howard's just <laughs> tell right to his face. And John's going to sit there and go, Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> I'd fuck it. I'd jump out the window if that was me. Oh. No, it wasn't. But you know, but go ahead and you know if that makes you feel better. Oh my lord, this is quite tense. I see OJ. He be scared. And Dan Foreman and I were editing my reel. It's the second time he's the told Nick this game, story. And they broke it out of the Nick game. And that I think it was a playoff game. And yes, cut to OJ or something like that. Something like that. Well, or they said it was going on, so we had to. And Dan and I looked at each other. Dan said, how soon before Captain Jenks gets through and does a phony phone call? And then sure enough. Yeah. He did. It wasn't wasn't (laughs) Captain Jenks. (laughs) Idiot. It wasn't Captain Ah. Jenks, but that guy was brilliant. And then, you know, and he did it to Peter Jennings. And then Al Michaels goes, Peter, uh, I just want to let you know that was a farcical call. Um, you know, the, there was a uh, phrase he used was which is in uh, which is indicative of a certain radio host, and then uh, Peter Jones goes, "Well, that won't be the first, and that won't be the last time we've been had." I remember it like it was yesterday. It's Can I just point out to, to, to John, he's a professional and better than all of us at this. One of the things you could have done. Is played that clip, <laughs> yeah. Rather than explain it poorly, yeah. Like I, I was listening to uh, Drew Lane's podcast today, and they were talking about the OJ stuff, and they played that. Yeah, it was fun to relive it. The nine one one call. You can play these things and then respond to them. This fucking idiot just sits there, and just goes, yeah. And then me and my buddy will listen, and then this happened. And then Jennings was like, "Who's this?" <laughs> And then the other guy was like, no, who's what this? Or something like that. It was something <laughs> like that. He was like, OJ's scared or something. I don't know. <laughs> He's so chip. Wow. It's unbelievable. Yep. <laughs> and a lady can't go, yeah, John lies about his IQ. Let's <laughs> fuck at that. No, I don't. Oh, that's the new thing now. When yeah. he does your voice, yeah. he adds suffering succotash every yeah. time. Now. And he's the one with spit flying out of his mouth. <laughs> yeah. He's the one. Yeah, he's the one with the fucked up mouth. <sighs> he did an impression of me the other night. I was going to play it on Point Dale Point. I'll play it tomorrow on WTP, where he's doing that thing. He's gargling and he's doing yeah. his thing. Like, I don't sound like that, but whatever. But he's embarrassing himself. 
Yeah. But by, by the time he gets to the end of it, he's red face and he's like making all these noises. <laughs> and I'm looking at him like, do you think people are laughing along with you at home? What do, what do you think is happening right now? He's the only one laughing at the end of that. And bit. then he and then he laughs at himself. Yeah. With the thing that he calls us all of us out for. They're of laughing course. at their own jokes. No, John, you are laughing at your own jokes, and they're not jokes. Yeah, we're laughing at funny jokes. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Big difference. It's been documented, you dumb fuck, Lady K. <laughs> On the Stern Show, I took the test. I scored a 136, and you're an idiot. Then why do, you say you're that? why do you say you're 160? Why do you say you're 161? And secondly, you took an internet version of the test. Ah. It wasn't a real version because Howard actually did real versions after you left the show when he went to Sirius. And the guy that took a test with you, I'm trying to remember who it is, Julie, you might remember. Is it Will? Who, or, uh... It might have been Will who also had a higher score, had a lower score when it was a real IQ test. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to think if it was Will or if it was the pace who it took wasn't it. The pace, but yeah. was it? Wh whoever it was, I just remember that John goes, yeah, I got a, a 136, and, and so they took it at face value. And then when they did the real tests and found out people's real IQs, mm -hmm. the guy he took it with had a lower score than what he got when he took right. it with John. Because, right. yeah, of course the internet's going to tell you, inflate your ego, be like, wow, you're really smart. Yeah. yeah. figure. Yeah. I mean, I, I remember when they did it at Sirius, they, they had to sit in a room with somebody, and that yeah. person had to administer the test. For that hours, is right. For hours, yeah. It was, uh, it was a whole thing. Yeah, John went to friendlies and did that <laughs> thing where you have to put the sticks in the triangle, and he's just like, I'm a genius. Nailed well, it. I remember Howard being so excited for the bit. And then as more and more people weren't available throughout the week, cause they were in the room taking a test it mm -hmm. just started pissing them off. And he's like, I wish at one point he's like, I wish we didn't even fucking do this bit. He was so pissed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sound Richard taking the test, you know, but like, imagine John scoring a one thirty six, which is what he right. said on the Howard Stern show. Right. And then changing that to one sixty one. I mean, the, the range there, it's not even in the same ballpark. No. no. <laughs> That's like going no. from single A ball and hitting three home runs to being Sammy Sosa. It's like, well, yeah, no, 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 you're not Sammy the, Sosa. Right to the Hall of Fame. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> what are you doing? You're not Barry it's, Bonds. What does that It's mean? fascinating because on one hand, you're going, look how intelligent this man is, and yet watch how dumb this plan is he's going <laughs> to put into effect. You know? How can both exist? It's right. amazing. And and contra what is going on with his eyebrows? He's starting to look like a mm. it's like a Halloween mask. This fucking well, this he's face. auditioning for the sitcom. <laughs> he's so bad when he had the Paulino picture from how he goes. I, 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 don't audition. Don't waste anyone's time, including your own. Please. <laughs> Someone asked him. Get it. Someone asked him, John, have you been on auditions lately? He goes, I don't know. There's an email from my manager in my inbox. It's probably an audition. <laughs> if it's not real estate info on Carl, I don't open it. <laughs> Very popular belief. Your IQ does go up. As No, as no it wait. doesn't. It's it not does. popular uh, belief. No. It's medicine, <laughs> no. you idiot. Yeah. It's not. He and thinks it it's doesn't. a trivia test. He it thinks does. it's a test of what you know. It's a test of how you learn, you fucking you moron. Wrong. No, no, Frog. I play woods with friends, so I'm getting much smarter. <laughs> No, you know what? I took the IQ 130, would have got 140, but I missed four NFL helmets on the test. <laughs> I couldn't match it up with the city. Now that I play Wordle, I'm at 145. <laughs> uh, uh, I got, I'm got. i gotten a text. Uh, Ganji and Jason Kaplan took the IQ test. Okay, with yes. Them. Uh, yes. K Rock. Yeah. Okay. It's just because you learn more, <laughs> you know? And that's just back check. School! <laughs> It's you not, learn not, more. Well, you can <laughs> learn more. I mean, you learn, what you get more information, but it's how you process the information is what the IQ test is. It's not, like you said, it's not trivia. Correct. Ugh. Ugh. Thanks for the two bucks. God to go, Jay, but you're still here. He hates us. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> John Sealing of Lies. <laughs> you know what I think this is? I am Dr. Remulak. I think this is... um. It's red, so as long as it has 99 in it, I guess, No. then it's red. <laughs> no. No. Because that's the only... Because... Uh, <laughs> grandma... <laughs> <laughs>
I don't know. I give. I throw my hands up at this one. I've guessed one or two things. I don't know. I'm John, the out. joke is when you lie, you like this. Uh, I think what happened was that's the joke, dummy. <laughs> Uh, where where was I again? Oh uh, yeah, uh, yeah. And then Scott to pace it. I'm the best. Of that. Yeah. Uh, Austin Cardi. Thanks for the two bucks. Too bad OJ died before a chance to kill Lisa Jodana. You know, uh, believe me, she's yeah. a fucking loon. We all knew that when she walked into my pub and fucking You're cranked him. My pub. Well, he probably spends more money than anyone there. So he could be a partner be. if he had just invested. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. He he has uh, stock in the company. <laughs> Music and fucking annoyed everybody in there. No, she just annoyed you. Everybody was for nobody. Nobody no, fucking. She, she is annoying. She is a well, she is. She is. is but like, streams. but she's also a hot chick. So annoying. You know, is there's more tolerance he, for annoying. Listen. He knew she was annoying. Okay. Yes. It's, 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 he, it's a roll of the dice. He said, I'll risk annoying for a chance to be with this uh, hot chick. Mm -hmm. and but who's more annoying to Stevie Tomatoes, Elisa Jordana or Stuttering John Melendez? If you go on their Yelp, there's more people complaining about Stuttering John Melendez mm -hmm. than Elisa Jordana. I'm just saying. Not, not only that, Carl, but I'll do you one better. What if he never went to Stevie Tomatoes and she wouldn't have embarrassed them at his pub? She could mm -hmm. have showed up at his house and they could have met there. And mm -hmm. the only reason why that didn't happen, because he invited her to his house, he was embarrassed that he hadn't had it furnished yet. It still mm -hmm. isn't. He didn't have a bedroom set up. There's three bedrooms in his house. And none of them have beds. So no. he was in Paris and he invited Elisa over to his house. She went to his house. And he threatened to call the cops. <laughs> yeah. She doesn't care about anybody but Elisa Jordana. Now, Lady K, that's a narcissist. I, however, am not. Well, you're right about one thing. <laughs> <laughs> Throw it. Uh, pussy. Game knows game, you know. Yep. There's another one. Uh, I like that in John's mind, he goes, that person's a narcissist, so I can't be. I think, no, no, no. <laughs> you both are. <laughs> I, like I there, was one, there was one spot open for a narcissist. <laughs> yeah, right. It's filled up now. I'm free yeah. and clear. <laughs> nice She's try. the Caitlin Dirty. Clark of narcissism. <laughs> right. <laughs> Almost got me on that one. Nice try. The monster energy drink. Skull! Yeah. <sighs> And, you know, as soon as I get the money, you know, then I'm like fucking wired. And I shouldn't have taken, I shouldn't have took it before the stress test. No, you should not have. I'm like, is this going to fuck it up? He's like, well, you're not supposed to. I said, I also had like a boost. <laughs> Doctor said, good thing your heart's perfect. This energy drink won't affect you any <laughs> during the stress <laughs> test. Shake. Yeah, you're not supposed to eat, eat a drink three hours before, four hours before. He goes, uh, why didn't you call? I go, I. I tried, but uh, but you guys wow. were on a two-hour lunch, you know. And he's like, "Yeah, I know." Man. But you know, he, he did said, "Not it ain't say matter. that." That is all lies. There's somebody yeah. there. There's always There's a receptionist. always someone there to answer the calls. It's not Mexico. <laughs> What's he talking about? <laughs> yeah. you, you guys are on a two-hour lunch, and the doctor goes, "Yeah, you uh, got it there, uh, John." And plus, I got nine holes in. Ah, oh, you yeah. got me. <laughs> two-hour lunch to make it. Do you want to ride on my plane? Sure. I, I love John's eating Smarties and Laffy Taffies on his way to his stress <laughs> test. They're like, um, John, you're not supposed to behave like a child. Like, I didn't see that in the pamphlet. I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> Let me ask you this question. Do you think that he even took this stress test? Oh, wow. Wow. Mind blown. Yeah, I don't think point. he even did it. What do you think of that? That's a great point because, first off, no one has a perfect heart. So right. that's dumb. Secondly... He was drinking a monster energy drink and he came home in between his two appointments yeah. and podcasted for a couple hours. I don't think he did. I think you're right. Wow. And what was he doing? Why did it, why was he walking and, and trying to lose weight? Then? That's the pro listen. This is the problem is he tries to put too many details in his lies. And in the course of it, like exposes that he's lying. Well, Mike, could it, could it thing. be that he did have an appointment for a stress test mm -hmm. and he didn't go? Ah, uh, that's very true. 
Or he showed said, up and he's just like, yeah, I've been drinking energy drinks all day. They're like, well, then we can't do this. You got to right. come back. That yeah. can, that we'll I really can do. Yeah. And, and somebody just said that a cardiologist wouldn't be at that stress test. It's not like they need to be there. Right. Also, they would the read the results and let yeah. you know. Yeah. Yeah. The results don't come to the patient. They go to the doctor. Yeah. The doctor discusses it with you. They don't come to him. Wow. That's a good straight. point. Yeah. I, I think you might be onto something. I, I remember I was uh, going to get a blood test or something. And they're like, if you eat a donut beforehand, they're like, oh, yeah, well, they then we can't do right. it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. You know, it's like they, it's a stress test. There's no fucking way you could drink a monster energy drink yeah. on the way to it. And they're just like, all right, yeah, it's fine. We'll yeah, just you're wasting their time because yeah. the, the results are, are not uh, uh, accurate. And the whole thing of like, I'm getting the finger checked and then I'm going for this, like yeah. on the same day, both oh, are scheduled. No. Like it's hard to get, you know, you, you got to, even if you have a fucking dental thing, sometimes you can't even get in that day. You know what I mean? Well, he like, said the day before he probably wasn't going to podcast because he had these two appointments and then all of a sudden mm. he's podcasting for two hours. Hmm. This is oh wow! I think we've discovered something right here. Dustin, yeah. can you look into that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I Dustin. need to get our PI on this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So my did, PI, like, his name is now. Dustin the Wind. <laughs> um, it's it, it isn't gonna hurt anything. Uh, so, <laughs> and uh, I said. That LOS, that's what I'm saying. What are the odds that you get both scheduled on the same day? Oh, and can, the hamburger. Yeah, can you put a tray with food on his on his hand? Take that shot. <laughs> Why does he do this? It's uncomfortable. It's 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 a lie thing. When he's lying, he starts pushing his fingers together. If you watch when he lies, when he goes on these rants, because in the Surely, middle of these... this show is great, man. I fucking love <laughs> Uncle Rico. Oh, you're banned. I love uh, BS. I mean, you oh, guys got to do some original you stuff. You and Mike the covers and Zen together. Killing. It's fucking incredible. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I thought I think uh, I think your band's great. I think you. <laughs> oh, well, we'll definitely yeah, you go see this? the isotope. <laughs> 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 People go over pity like I go ice it down. Ice it down. Uh, I got. Uh, uh, well, yeah. And now, Carl, here's the thing about this: is I think his fingers are <coughs> are kind of clawed like that. Mm -hmm. So, because I mean, if you just rest your hand like that, yeah. it's right. it's like this, right? It's, right. You know, like that's it's that's at, at, at ease. But to do this, mm. that takes energy. Like that takes um, energy. Uh, stress. Well, it really doesn't. It just takes a, a full season on a crab fishing boat <laughs> to get your hand like that. That's the claw that yeah. they talk about getting on Deadliest Catch. So, yeah, <laughs> that's all it takes. Some people were saying his this was you want to talk about mind blowing. Somebody suggested in the chat the other day, and I'm sorry, I don't remember who, who did it. That his finger is in that condition from all the opening of cans of beer uh, throughout yeah. the years. It's very possible. <laughs> Uh, Ed. Oh shit! Uh, uh, oh, I do I have an audition. I might have an audition. This is great news. Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> you already know it's a prank. Like you just hear it, you go, somebody got it. Somebody get doing. Well, might have an audition. Working actors have auditions all day long, every day. Correct, every day. <laughs> I mean, you're you're gonna get point. One two percent of your auditions are gonna land a role. So having he, one audition doesn't mean anything. He said it like he just found twenty bucks in a pair of jeans yeah. he washed. <laughs> he go, Whoa, look at this! I got an audition. Whoa, that's wow. Cool. <laughs> look, they're going down. Either you go on the sinking ship, and look contribute. At this. Julie, Somebody agrees with leave you. Out Vince the lawyer. Good You're not parts. the only one that feels oh. that way. See, hmm. look at that. Thank you, Kinky Loco. I'm a big, big supporter of Vince. I want to try and leave as much of him in here as possible. I'm sorry. We'll get on that. We're going to have a band meeting after the show. We'll get on that. To those really? losers. There's not that much of Vince. <laughs> <laughs> really? I don't know what you watch that you think is uh, amazing, but I mean, if it's good, we'll leave it in. A lot of times it's not. Hold on. Is this where John's predicting that uh, Bob Levy's going to leave the Shuli mm -hmm. Network? Mm -hmm. I, th I believe right. so. I think this is, this is a brand new thing he's, he's saying now. Okay. 
or you give it to the goat. At least the goat, you know, look, I'll get good. Trust me, I'm working on some really good guests. I know I said that in the past, but that was during the fucking actors strike. <laughs> now all bets are off. Now all bets are off. All bets are off. What does that mean? It means nothing. Throw it. Do it. Do it. Throw it. Come on. You got no room on that table. Yeah. yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, missed. To the right. <laughs> oh, bad. To the right. Nice shirt. Do you I just want to hear one day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <he's here>. yeah. <laughs> so, so John yeah. says that you know he, he was claiming a long time ago he was going to get, start getting some great guests on the show, and then he said, "Yeah, Jack Black was going to come on, but you know, there's this they're not touring, or they they're touring right now, and then you yeah, checked and they and weren't then, and, touring, and then he's <laughs> right, and then he said you know, I was going to get this, but there's the actor strike. The actor strike had nothing to do with going on podcasts, nothing at all. They're allowed to go on any nice. podcast they wanted to, they just couldn't." acting things right but carl they started a podcast with all yes! the late night talk show hosts <laughs> right. doing a podcast together <laughs> most actors have a podcast at this fucking point yeah hey guys nobody's doing podcasts because of the strike you yeah. know they're not gonna cross the picket line for me guys come on but now Ready? he says and we're, and we're a year out of it and he goes <laughs> but now that it's over i'm gonna start getting big guests and i know i said that before but this time you can trust me We'll see, John. I'm like COVID, you never know. It could just come right back. So we got to, you know, got to stay vigilant. Head on a swivel. Collars. Hmm, not sure I understand that. <laughs> Skull. <sighs> Skull. You were Bowie's biatch. Really? You think so, Rev? I just played you a clip the other day where Bowie said I was working for him. Yeah. You want me to play it for you, Rip Fugly? No. No. To fucking jog your memory? It sucked yesterday and it's going to suck today. Uh, I'm very, I'm actually, I'm, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Julie. Well, no, I was just going to say, that in, in the context of Gary saying that, it was more like John's walking around thinking he's my boss. Like, right. I'm working for him. John was a you know? tattletale. Exactly. He was obnoxious. That was the right. point of that. Right. right. Wasn't a compliment. I'm kind of obsessed with he's he's missed every can he's thrown so far. Yeah. So a 500 square foot, I, I was looking up, you know, different different dimensions. At the most, it's probably 25 feet long. <laughs> The, yeah. the entire the entire space so yep. he's right in the middle with the couch so that's you know so uh, you know eight, but take eight. this into effect every shot is different because depending on how much beer is left in the can that's that's there's a true. different amount of weight yeah. to every can but he but, cannot be throwing more than 10 feet 10 right and that being said he does this every night so you'd think if right. you practice free throws 500 times a day yeah. you'd be pretty fucking okay at free throws well yeah. hold on he beat shaquille o'neal basketball who also could not <laughs> get the free throw down true. true all he needs is one i bet he makes one can like you made one shot against yeah. Shaq. that's <laughs> it he goes well that's a win, win again. boys <laughs> <laughs> let's head home so easy you know, like you guys don't realize. Yeah, Roy Ray. Are we factoring <laughs> it's in too easy wind for resistance? me? <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. 1930. There we go. Here we go. Oh, hey, here you go, dickhead. Hey, let's see. Let's see, you fucking idiot. All right, you ready, dumbass? You can do stand up. Well, well just... maybe they can. Thanks for the two bucks. Why did you OJ Kate Meany? <laughs> I don't know. She's with some dude now. Uh oh. And, uh, you know, this yeah. ain't going to end well. What? This ain't going to end well. Guaranteed. This, Why? Th this will be another uh -oh. shit relationship that she gets us up into. Uh oh, Daddy don't approve. Uh, huh? Was I was jealous. Is it a black man? What's going on, Chad? Oh, what are you upset about? Oh, oh, please. Oh, okay. <laughs> Send me a picture of your new boyfriend. I gotta see what he looks like. But that's what she's gonna do. Kate's boyfriend, no good guy. He no good guy. <laughs> Ryan A. 
Thanks for the two bucks. Finish the lyrics. Poor little <laughs> Howie thought he was a boon. Okay. What? Wow. It's nice also save. a little racist. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Good improv, John. I mean that does not yeah. sound unracist. <laughs> wow. Is that is that Ryan Styles? That was. <laughs> I was just going to say impressive. by watching whose line is it anyway? <laughs> wow. Well done, <laughs> sir. Three points. Uh, that's our little game called Party Court, guys. <laughs> uh, we'll be right back. <laughs> Now, Carl, and here uh, talking about the music, your thoughts on his singing? I mean, never mind his terrible guitar oh, playing. I mean, man. I mean, is is that just from the ravages of drinking? And I, but I mean, he, literally, I've never heard him do anything in tune. Yeah, he on the show last night was talking about how he's an entertainer, <laughs> and so he went to school for entertainment, and that's what he does for a living. That's what he does. And then he goes, "I've been doing this since I was like six or seven. And he starts singing a show tune oh. and he picks the wrong key. So oh, he, he was, gets to uh, a register he can't hit. Fiddler on the roof or something, yeah. right? Uh. Yeah. <laughs> so it was so funny. It's like, oh, I, I could do this in my sleep. And then he's like, uh, wow. I it was better when I was six. <laughs> it's like that clip of Howard's dad singing in the wrong octave. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> yeah. Oh, hello. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was 35 years ago. I think maybe even maybe someone that was 38 years ago. Really? 38 years ago? Let's talk about when he stepped in that center Fuck. fold he's still bragging about. <laughs> and Joe Biden said all uh Indians own 7 Eleven in 38 years ago. In 38 yeah. <laughs> pull it up, he did. <laughs> Times are changing. Well, also we Biden uh, passed that bill in '94 that made it so black people go to jail for a lot longer for having crack cocaine than white people with cocaine. Right. But no, no, he's the best. He's the best right. ever, Jack. So Keep going. In other words, in other words, uh, he's going to win again. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> change, we change with them. Uh, oh, when he claps, <laughs> he, when he claps that to beat. I'm sorry to, to obsess on this, but talking with uh, with Carl is when he, when he starts clapping. He's not even clapping on the beat. Yeah, Listen. someone pointed out to me he does one and three. Musicians do two and four. Right. Uh, he, he should know better. I don't want to get too technical. Posers do one and three. <laughs> yeah. That's well, some fucking. Way, uh, and I am terrible. I am no professional musician by any stretch of the imagination. But he makes me feel so much better. Yeah. Well, you're both you both don't know shit because Josh reminds us all perfect pitch gets better oh. as you get older, much like your IQ. So there you go. <laughs> I, I don't play a lot of instruments, but uh oh, oh. <laughs> I'll show hey, off a little bit. It's it's wacky Uncle Rico Friday. Let's <laughs> go, Stevie man. It ain't it ain't gonna end well with Stevie. Cut him loose, Kev. Look what he did to me in only a matter of days. Your mom's box. Hey, Stevie, your wife's box. Okay? Boom. Wow. Wow. You still hung up on your mom's oh, box. Wow. This guy, everything's his 9-11. It's unbelievable. Oh. Does that make it better? Yeah, you're all you're all sensitive about your wife, but you didn't give a fuck about my mother. Did ya? Did ya? Take that stress test now. Yeah, fake anger, John. Yeah, I know. It's so stupid. Stevie Lou made an Opie and Anthony reference, mm -hmm. and um, you showed photos of his wife on your show. Bit of a difference there. Bit of a difference. Yeah. Dummy. Yeah. So in other words, Stevie, you can dish it out, but when it's given back to you, <sighs> then you can't take it. He's his own yeah. bully. It's great. <laughs> Oh, oh, spit it, spit it. I see you reenacting his bukkake scene. I mean, I can't imagine drinking Coors Light, much less gargling it. <laughs> oh, this the dentist, the one, dentist said, my, my mouth is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> dentist just called, my hugger is perfect. <laughs> Oh, hold on, I gotta... Fuck. Fucking hell. Yeah. Hold on. <laughs> that hand just comes creeping up into the shot. It's the weirdest thing. <laughs> the guy just popped up. 
<laughs> watch, look at it. Oh, hold on, I got it. Watch, it's gone. Uh, hold on. I'm trying to try to get a signal. Put your arm up higher. So my guy. Do you guys remember when died. Jordan? No. Jordan had the best moves of any NBA player in the history. Yeah. And he would go up for that crazy dunk or something, and his tongue was big. Yes. Like, and you see guys make guitar face from time to time and like really into it. This is what John, when he's concentrating on something, he can't control his hand. He can't. Whether he's drinking a beer or texting someone mm -hmm. or like, it's just like, it's like, that's like his Jordan hand. Yeah. He's like, remember the NASCAR Will Ferrell movie, uh, yeah. Talladega or whatever? And you know, he's talking too. and he's like, I don't know what to do with my hands. <laughs> he's doing the interview. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Who actually went to the Chitway show? That Ooh. bomb of a show uh -oh. in uh, Point Pleasant, New Jersey. The one where there's video, silent? according to him, there's video of Silent Mike falling outside of Uncle oh. Vinny's and dropping his prop underwear that he oh, uses I in his act. That. I saw that. He doesn't even know that we have it now. Yeah. He doesn't even know. Uh, Mike fell, <laughs> and he dropped this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you this, John? Uh, there you go. There you go. Thanks for Fact. Thanks. Oh, thank you. Okay. It is yours. Back. It is yours. We all we actually all have them because we do a whole thing yeah. at the end where we do. Yeah, we this put our dicks thing. in it and sort of. Yeah. Fun. Yeah. And I guess that well, I'm holding it upside down. I don't even know. Well, you don't know much. He dropped that. You don't know how underwear Which is goes. A prop they've been using about use my underwear to guide. <laughs> so this it's was upside a prop down. Stupid. That you can't see the word photo is upside down on your phone, John. <laughs> you can't tell. But if he's trying to get people to not come to your shows, this isn't working. I want to see. <laughs> oh, no. yeah, this no. is like a good bit. <laughs> oh, it's killer, it's killer. <laughs> we, you don't know. It's part of this whole. Ouija yeah. thing we do where we try to contact John on the squeegee board that was made for us. I'm sold. Uh, I'm in. Where's yeah. the next show? I'm coming. Yeah. I look at the top message. I add water. It's basically Gatorade. <laughs> they have some of his best quotes on this. So, you know, we're trying to contact his career. See if we can find it. Silent Mike drop. That's not a picture. I took no, it on this, you know, on the table. So I, you know, this prop <laughs> has been sent to me. Uh oh. Hmm. So if Silent Mike wants to go back and realize, holy shit, I lost my prop. <laughs> and I'm waiting. This one. See if I get, if I've gotten it. <laughs> Oh, there's so much shit that uh, I have. I don't. Let's see. Now, can he not see the shit on his lip? That's all I'm looking at now. <laughs> I, I mean, address that. No, not in spam. No. Not no <sighs> mail. Nope. No. Not in trash. No. Well. No. No. Not there. In trash. So. I saw a great shirt I want to get John the other night. I was watching the show and the guy had a shirt that said, All trash, no trailer. <laughs> and I go, That's a great John shirt right there. I don't know how I didn't get this, <coughs> but I didn't get it. <coughs> John, do you tune your guitar by ear? Yes. <laughs> yeah, use your yeah. fingers next time. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> 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 but it's, so it's never as perfect as a, you know, as a tuner. What? I'm <laughs> Thanks for the fuck. Wait, wait, wait. So he said he uses his ear, but it's never as perfect as a tuner. Okay. Wow. So when you're sitting all alone in your apartment, you wonder what you did wrong in life, how you fucked everything up. Top of the world to 500 square feet. I don't know. I don't. I don't view this as a downside. 
Oh, yeah. like I, I think I'm still doing what I love doing, entertaining, yeah. drinking, and I'm never. Yeah, his cores is half full yeah. always. He's gonna stop. <laughs> This is your personality disorder, John. This is what yeah. I've been trying to explain to you. Mm -hmm. right. Anyone else would reset and go, oh, fuck, I fucked up. What's going right. on? Not John. He's still killing it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. This is mental illness is what yes. you're showing here, John. Correct. So this is what this is my calling. Always has uh, been and always will be. And I'm going to do it. Uh, That's, uh uh, Thanks for the fiber. Is it true? Men's Health Magazine reached out to you recently for a couple of shows to see you in the Gold's Gym t-shirt. Yes. It's entirely true. And when you see my body without a shirt on, Ugh. oh my no. God, it's lovely. And you know if it was, John would be doing the show shirtless. Of you course. understand? He, he If he had anything to show off, He'd be showing it off mm -hmm. the second he can. I'm almost as dreamy as Hitika! Again, he keeps talking about dudes Hello. being dreamy and that he's into them. It's like well, specifically uh, Adam. Adam and KB. I mean, at this point, I think he'll take anybody from that show. Well, I think he loves Kevin for his mind. He loves Adam for his body. Yeah. He just wants to use Adam, right? Like the like the fuck pig that he is. That that was a whole weird thing that happened this week, where he's been making fun of Adam Pinnaker for months. You know, yeah, him thin skinnaker and whatever. <laughs> right, googly and then, eyes. Yeah, googly, yeah, yeah. Nonstop goofing on Adam Pinnaker. Oh, you're the worst of them all, Adam Pinnaker. <laughs> and then Adam leaves the show, and they they bring in CB Lou. And John's like, what were you thinking, KB? Everyone loves Adam Hinnika. You you done fucked up, boy. It's like, well, the best is he's like, he trashes Adam for months, and then it's Adam's last day, and he goes, farewell, my friend. All the best. <laughs> but that's, that's what I mean. And I don't think anyone watches John's show and is a fan of John. I honestly don't. If there is someone out there, Noga or whoever, I'd, I'd love to. Robert Myers. I think Robert that's Myers, it. Uh, Disco Bob. Come on, WTP. I'd love to talk to you about it. Because how could you possibly enjoy a show where John says all sorts of crazy shit and then just says the exact opposite a week right. later? Just a 180 turn. You're like, well, then why are you listening to anything he has to say? That's why I stopped listening to Zumach. I'm like, well, he's just lying. Who cares? What's the point? Mm -hmm. Well, it was like uh, three weeks ago. He knew without a shadow of a doubt that you went into this pub <laughs> yes, and right. wrote FSJ. Jump me, and they all know it was me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And that A, you're you're going to be invoiced for the cleanup. Yeah, you know, <laughs> B, authorities are be are going to be called mm -hmm. in. They're going to be involved. You are 86 from the property. Uh, you, <laughs> all this stuff. Fast forward to today, I hear him go. Ah, they cleaned it up. It's not that big of a deal. He goes, what, what do you want him to do? You know? And it's just like, it's fuck, incredible. man. He's so stupid. You're the one who painted this whole fucking yeah. doom and gloom scenario for your enemy because he wants to win so bad. The second he thinks he has something, mm -hmm. his mind is already jumping to you and Vinny sharing a cell, right. you know, yes, you being know. attacked by, you know, the Aryan nation. That's part of, of his black. personality disorder is right. he has these revenge fantasies. I've I right. this out on the show recently yes. where it's very childish and you think like no one could actually behave like this. This can't be real. And then you find out, oh no, there's actually this weird personality flaw that John has mm -hmm. where he, he actually fantasizes like he would rather me lose than him win. A hundred percent. And that's a very weird thing. Like most people are just like, well, I don't care what John's up to. I'm happy that I'm doing well, but John would rather see me. So someone posted on a subreddit, probably a uh, hack first or something. They showed that my Patreon was down 6% from July of last year until um, April 1st of this year. Right. And uh, so, so we were down 6% and John is last out of it. He's like, his numbers are plummeting. <laughs> They're tanking. They're, They're tanking. The lady can't can see all he wants. His numbers are plummeting. I'm doing way better than him. It's like, John, you're not even in the same fucking zone. What are you talking about? It's not even close. We're down 6% April 1st from July of last year. What are you, what are you talking about? But well, also, in John's mind, he just sees someone not doing as well, and that's a win for him. 
First of all, every first of the month, everybody's numbers drop. Correct. Number yes. one, yes. unless you pay annually, your your subscription ends and you have to renew it. Manually. Well, if if your credit card expires, okay, you that have to go too. In, that's why that happens. So, right. so people's credit cards expire who are just on a you know a monthly thing and then they, mm -hmm. they go away. So every if you look at anyone's Patreon, they always dip on the first of the month. Plus, also, yeah. you guys started doing YouTube memberships, and there are a lot more people using YouTube than Patreon. And sometimes it's easier for people to go. We've had a lot of people that went uh, from uh, Patreon over to YouTube. Yeah, we literally started in August. Exactly. So, we, so we now we have a bunch of people. That. They get the same perks you get on Patreon, you get on, right. on YouTube. So literally, we have hundreds of people who are on our YouTube uh, memberships, but you know, whatever it's, it's neither here nor there. I'm, I'm not saying that we're, we're killing it. We've plateaued it. That's fine. But for John to say the word plummeting and that's, he wants that to be true so badly. He and needs so it to be true. Yes. He needs it to get through to tomorrow. He needs yes. that to be true. So that's pathetic. a fact. He's like, uh, Carl will be probably begging for money on the street tomorrow. I was like, no, no, I'll, I'll be fine. I'll, I'll be right. uh, Reminds me of this gem. The shit wear tried and successful, successfully got me to accidentally <laughs> post a picture of a Pocky product with a swastika on it that I didn't see. I mean, talk about taking the long way around. Jesus Christ. Well, it, it cracks me up because John is constantly saying Bob Levy's going to leave TSA. Right. And he goes, and once that happens, it's all over. And it's going to happen any day now. <laughs> He's been saying that for eight months. <laughs> At what know. point are you embarrassed, John? At what point? <laughs> if it hasn't happened yet, it ain't going to happen, girl. DJQ, thanks for the fire. But does it matter, part-time and full-time, you still didn't provide for your family. Disgusting. Oh. Really? You know what that's in I reference to? Because I What's watched that? this. So someone said, hey, John, it's pretty bad that Susanna had to have three jobs because you weren't paying child support. And John goes, they weren't three full-time jobs. No one thought there were three full-time jobs. That would be 24 hours a day. Unbelievable. And a full-time job is eight hours a day. He yeah. goes, they weren't even three full-time jobs. So this guy goes, yeah, no, no, that's not what we're saying here. We don't care if his partner or full-time. The point is, you have three kids. You were giving them zero money for a while. Like eight months, you gave them zero. Uh, yeah. Go, oh, no, that's just one side of the story, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's the side, but okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it's the most compelling side of the story, John. I hate to break it to you. Holy shit! There, that's rich. You're not. <laughs> oh, I did. Oh, can you I read music. Did. I don't know. No, I don't think he can. No. My brother read English. I did. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good point no i think i've heard him say that he can't read music that's my ex's brother i like shit in tubs thanks for the point <laughs> yeah but now i got a full one dude i you know i mean you come on like like when you did it it was half a full one uh, all right. come on you bitch oh, Chug is... it. Uh, <laughs> hey sweetie i'm live What, are you stripping that guy now? That Boots guy? I don't get her. She's like, one minute she's like, I'm out. I don't need this anymore. And then she just can't stay away. She's got to come back and get involved with these fucking people that, that made her run away in the first place. Yeah. That's Kate. I, Kate Meany. Kate, Kate Meany. Is that, is that his mom? No. <laughs> you still fucking Mike Moss? What, do, what did I tell you about that? You stupid that guy, Ma. Yeah. Here's my girlfriend, Kate Meany. Uh, Again, another thing he needs to be real. He needs uh, it to be true. Right. He just needs uh, to hear it. Yeah, right you need to hear my girlfriend whoever yeah i'll give you a big chug <laughs> John, are you pledging <laughs> that's it you Come pussy on, you do this every day for hours on end 15 to 20 beers a day and that's the best you got fuck for an old fucker like me that's pretty good 
He's funny. Can't say he's not funny. Look at that. It's a funny face. That's a guy lecturing uh, Stevie Lou on how to do a good broadcast earlier in this episode. <laughs> he's the talent. <laughs> the talent. Are you fucking with me? Am I supposed to think uh, that they're taking pictures of me? What? What? What's this? Raise chat up. Here we go. It's favorite pastime. Mm-hmm. Yep. Scroll. Uh, um, yeah. All right. Oops. <laughs> 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 it looks like a good video. Yeah. Check that one out, John. It's always the best when he stumbles across one. He's just like, no, I'm going to read yeah. that. I'm going to do no. that. Not reading that. No. <laughs> uh, it, 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 it. <laughs> that was a great picture of me. Go back up. All right. Let's see what we got here. Uh. uh. All right, clip number one. Let's. This is where, and I'm going to give you the explanation here. I bet. This is where the shit way you said. Shit way justifies stealing from Ronnie and Scott Salem during the block party shows. I did. So in essence, and this is the, this is something you should all know. And this is truly down to a T. He'll yeah. grift. He's fucking, he's fucking Bob. He's fucking Silent Mike, but he's too stupid to know it. He's fucking uh -huh. Log Cabin Larry. What? Ignore him. You don't. You don't even what? Don't want. Don't worry about him. And he's fucking Philip Joe fucking Russo. He's fucking everybody. So not discount. All right. That's no good. discount. Fucks me. Yeah, Let's discount's go. killing it. <laughs> Let's go. You know it, brother. Well, they, <laughs> don't know it because they've been duped they've been duped so now what was that movie uh the invasion like they're all drinking like the kool-aid so now what the invasion you talking about jonestown <laughs> jonestown was not a movie but okay whatever <laughs> i mean <laughs> wow okay then these aliens bring punch bulls down. <laughs> Touch the shit way of saying he's justifying why he took more money than them. What's that movie with uh, John Travolta? Uh, Scientology is what I'm thinking. <laughs> yeah, <that's> what <laughs> yeah. Yeah. My mentality was since I was doing 45 minutes, maybe I should make more money. And since I'm booking the show yeah. and, and picking the venues and yeah, since, setting it all since up. Since Scott the Engineer doesn't have a set, he's not doing anything <laughs> yeah. entertaining. Yeah. Uh, here's Scott's set. Do you have a USB to iPhone cord? <laughs> Thank you. I need to set up my equipment. Hey, you guys familiar that with the Howard Stern show? Ooh. I'm on it. Yeah. That being uh, said, Scott did do more than John did on his because all John did was play a, a, a tape, right? Absolutely. Yeah. At least Scott did a stupid dance to one yeah. of the Rich, Black Eyed Peas song. I have to say... John left that tape behind, much like you did with the underpants. Oh, yes. Yeah, <laughs> John. <laughs> Hopefully someone oh, mails yeah. it back to you. Yeah. Maybe someday. Hey, welcome. Now, let's an analyze that. Shit way <laughs> Did Beetlejuice do time? Beetlejuice? No. But you brought them there because people wanted to see them. Yeah. No, Beetle you. did Beetle did one block party show. Uh and whack packers in general weren't really at the block party shows. And also they weren't even on the posters or any of the advertisement. They showed up to a lot of shit. High pitch mm -hmm. used to come to shows, sour would come to shows. Uh and what Speech am I going to be man? I think. Yeah. Right? And am I going to sit there and go, no, 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 no. You're mm. not booked. You're not coming mm. up here. Let put, bring them. Once we finish the show, here was the plan, right? Once we get done with the comics at the end of the night, we bring the wag packers up to say hello. That's yeah. it. So you're doing it wrong. You'd have to charge them $500 to go on stage. Believe it or not, I would actually give that money. That's what a fucking idiot. I was, uh, I saw uh Shuli in Vegas a couple of years ago. 
And after the show, I'm hanging out with Shuli backstage, and he goes, "Hey, Carol, this is a speech part of my mind." I went, "Oh, neat." Yeah, <laughs> yeah, cool. <laughs> Well, the worst is I have to do that with Brad Garrett. I go, Brad Garrett, my friend's speech impediment man. Yeah. Brad Garrett's like, hello. And he's like, hello, I love Raymond. You know, whatever the fuck. You are my fourth favorite character. I have, I have video on my phone of my mom in Brad Garrett's green room, my mom and dad hanging out with Brad and his wife, and she's telling them this story. And I just pan the camera over and there's high pitch sitting in the green room as if he's part of my family hanging out with all of us with the dumbest mouth open look on his face you've ever seen. And that's why you sold those tickets. Shoot. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Because they were the attraction. They never were there to do time shit way. They were there. That's why the show was six minutes long, too. We saw it was over <laughs> six and a half minutes. To sell you tickets. Nobody did time. It's that fucking simple. Isn't this asshole the guy who charged Melrose, Melrose Larry Green yeah. 500 bucks to uh -huh. open a his show? show? Yeah. A show. A show. 500. Uh -huh. 500. Yeah. That, that's way more damning than what you're yes. saying, Julie did, John. So stop pretending. Because you bored the audience with your shitty stand-up. Finally, that the first you honest did thing you said. <laughs> That's true. Therefore, you should be paid more. No, 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 no. They were there for the draw. That last chord saw somebody really check. Oh yeah, that oh, last core was like a course was like a spike strip. He's down to rims right now. <laughs> Just sparks and rims flying out of this car. Well you were uh uh you were the guy that was uh um you know take, I take your time. I would do I don't know. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> <laughs> There's that lying ceiling. There See, it that, is. See what that says. When I started with the Stuttering John Friends so I was up to like 10, 15, maybe 20. Wow. And and what, your video or your time? Which one was up mm. to 20? Your video was 15 minutes. I remember that. John's the only guy who's looking at the eclipse days afterwards. Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Put on the glasses, John. It's dangerous. <laughs> Yeah, I see him coming in tomorrow with some hot eclipse material. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and Nick DiPaolo and Jim Florentine and Modi, they took time. But who was the draw? Me. So shit where the draw for your show. Now, again, his, his whole point in bringing this up was to expose me yet here he is exposing himself. Correct. The, the nerve, the chutzpah, this fucking guy to be in a green room, to be in a venue with guys like Artie, Nick DiPaolo, Jim Florentine that would run fucking circles around this fucking uh -huh. sideshow act and to sit there and go, they weren't the draw. I yeah. was. You know what? The You know why people didn't burn the fucking venues down? Because <laughs> those comics were there and did the job that you cannot do uh -huh. and could never do, which is being funny. He's such an Back. asshole. O Opie and Anthony used to do the virus tour, and it's very famous Bill Burr in Philadelphia. Yeah. yeah. Where everyone's just being rowdy, and he just tore the whole audience down. Do you think Opie made more money than Bill Burr that night? John, is that what you think was going on? For real. What an asshole. Was Scott the engineer and Ronnie the limo driver? <laughs> Therefore, yeah. I can't wait to meet Scott the engineer. <laughs> yeah, let me tell you what happened at a meet and greet once. Uh, Scott went and took a picture with a couple. He still hadn't finished eating. He got barbecue sauce all over her dress, all over. <laughs> sat there, and posed for a picture, and then I hear, "I'm so sorry about that. Maybe we'll take care of that." Now I got to pay a cleaning bill because of Scott. <laughs> they should be paid more, like I was paid more. I was the drawer. But you know what's funny about this, John, is those guys, well, Ronnie never complained about the money ever once. He was very happy with the money. Scott, Scott was making great money for playing four songs off of his cell phone mm -hmm. until he started complaining that he wanted more money. And, and then he flaked on shows and JD stepped in and the rest was history.
Then it then it went into the next level. You were never the draw. N- nobody liked you. Doesn't matter how much time you did on stage, because when you got on stage, if Scott and Ronnie were hanging out at the bar, everybody was hanging with them. He knew he was there. Well, he would have been at the bar, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Period. Oh. School. Yeah, that School. last that last chorus hit hard, man. He oh, is. wait. He got t- that last chorus t boned him in an <laughs> intersection. <laughs> guy wants to kill me. But you know what? I don't play on. Yeah. Ugh. Come on, your heart's perfect. You got this. Yeah. The hand comes up like he's walking a tightrope, <laughs> balancing himself. Dude, I, I haven't drank like this since we are going into a Bills game. And we're like, yeah, you gotta drink it. We gotta get in. We gotta get in. Let's go. <laughs> Kick oh, kickoff. Man. Kickoff yeah. is starting. Let's go. Let's go. All right. All right. You're right. The one uh, uh, I tuned in a couple times on Point Down Point, and I think it was you brought this up when he was doing Kumia's show with Jackie. Yes. And he goes to Jackie, he goes, You're still on your first beer. And Jackie's like, You're still doing that as yeah. an adult? Like, <laughs> what? trying to shame us for not drinking fast <laughs> enough? We're in our 50s. What, what's going on? Uh, frat boy John, man. <laughs> never, never fucking grew up. <laughs> oh, no, that did not go in, you, no you lying sack of shit. That no was a floor way. right there. Closing strong. Let's see. Uh... Uh, uh, Tivo Boba, and that's it. Uh, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. The package, uh, shout out to Frog and Discount Boys in the Back. Great job. Uh, we got super chats to catch up on. Carl, if you want to get out, man, it's yeah, late. I, I got a cruise, uh, I got to listen to some voicemails, get ready for my show tomorrow. But thank you both very much for having me and, and Frog you, and uh, Discount Don. Thanks, guys. Always love who coming are these, on. Uh, who are these dot com? Right? Yes. Who are these dot com is where you can find all things. Who are these podcasts? And of course, Hackamania dot com. Promo code WATP. Twenty percent off your tickets. We'll be in Vegas May thirty first through June second. And uh, if you do sign up for our Patreon or our YouTube, you get to watch the shows live. So tomorrow at two p.m. We do uh, Who Are These Podcasts? Wednesdays at 5. You can watch the shows live when we do them. Thank Guys, thanks so much for having me. Thank hey, you, Carl. love Great you, buddy. You. Thanks for ch- jumping in here. Appreciate it. Have a good night. Carl, ladies and gentlemen, come on. Uh, every woman he meets should have to watch his hygiene montage before he's allowed to speak. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it ain't even going to get that far. Please don't ever play that again, I beseech you. Oh, the sneeze? Oof. Yeah, that'll probably be in the intros. <laughs> when we redo them. Uh-huh. Uh, thank you, uh, Mookie Stinks. Appreciate it. Rev Fugly, do the rest of the show as Joey C. <laughs> Please, Shuley. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't see that, Fugly. Rex Kramer, John acts like his computer's the equivalent of the warehouse of the Ark of the Covenants locked away in. This is how all Fridays should end. Thanks. Thank you, Rex. I got a text from Joey, by the way. I didn't get a chance to read. What did that guy say? Breaking news, breaking news. Joey C will be in Vegas. Only $200 left to the goal. All right. All right, there you go. There's an update. Carl, yay, yell at us. I mean, tell us what's up. (laughs) Thank you, Rev. Carl's a yeller. Carl, you in the witness protection program still? Dustin is 10 steps behind you. (laughs) Look out. Oh, real quick. I had, uh, speaking of updates, on the goddamn phone. I got a couple things here from our pal uh, Mule. Ooh, I would like to see that. Those always make me laugh. Yeah, this is him watching us tonight, commenting in real time on his Twitter. Oh, nice. Go for a sneeze this time? Wash the hair. uh, You see the T? When the hair comes around and connects with the T, it's an upside (laughs) down (laughs) cross. Antichrist. Who cares? Let's just enjoy it. Antichrist. In general, people, people, 
Yeah. What is that? Hold on. Oh, oh I had it. <laughs> ah, God! See? Oh, look at his hair. <laughs> oh, the hair. See, it's, people, it's getting close. Is he saying when the hair connects with yeah. the cross, yeah. it's yeah. that's it's on? Oh shit! Talking like, like look at that alien face hugger and just it becomes a, the T becomes a cross, and that's oh a, yeah. my god, he's right. Yeah. <laughs> what in the what? Oh. <laughs> what is that? What mark? is that on his fucking mouth? It's, Come on! I mean, get out of here with this. <laughs> Did he mess around with a marker like some idiot I know, yeah, and he yeah. can't get the marks off now? Yeah, that's gonna hurt, John. <laughs> <laughs> this a price, motherfucker! <laughs> Look at it. He's trying to do the best of price. He's not shaving yet. Look at the hair. The hair. It's all about the hair. It really is. That string of hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Two of them. See? Oh, it get, it's getting there. Good night, everybody. Emergency <laughs> show. <laughs> yeah, my <laughs> Emergency show. <laughs> What's on the side of his fucking face? <laughs> Holy shit. That, was that is what is fucking on the side of his face. <laughs> that is terrible. He said, Holy fuck, that, that killed great. me. You'll love you, man. <laughs> I got one more a quickie oh, from him. Oh, I love this guy. I like lip. to make money. Upper <laughs> lip. That's what I do. Mm. Fuck. Have oh. I had hard times in my life? Yes. Sure. No. <laughs> when I worked for free, for Stern, while going to NYU. What the hell is that? And graduating. <laughs> ah! He <laughs> hit. He <laughs> hit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's best follow on Twitter. Right. I want him. I want Frog. When, when you guys do your wrap up show, you got to get Mule involved oh, yeah. with the wrap up show. Oh God! Uh, Shuli, the dues payer, Carl, the guitar shredder. Mm -hmm. I can't wait for you two to break down his. Get it's gonna make him nuts. Oh, he will. Yeah. Uh, it's uh, Dustin Rock Rocky, <laughs> Dustin <laughs> Rakey. A detective agency, oh. aka oh, Tim Oh, it's an anagram. Uh, oh. Mm. Hey, Snaggletooth, remember when you used to trash Bob for being a crowd work hack? Look at this shirt. You like him now? What happened? Sorry, Dom, he's not here. Uh oh, I got to sneeze. Uh, uh. <laughs> 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 All right, See? I paused me to, you know why? Because I have a perfect heart. Yeah. Mm. Uh, Carl, when you go to prison, can I be your pen pal? Granny banger. Yeah. I'll vouch for you, Granny. Truly, I live in Vegas. You're on posters in every casino. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, shit. Uh, Dang Lizard, think Stuttering John will say thank you if I tell him uh, there is this thing called a URL slash link you mm -hmm. can copy from your browser to remember where it's already. Once you get to, there's a URL, and he's like, uh, it's too much. It's too much. Uh, you misread my gifted membership. Uh, take that, that you dirty shooly. Okay. Hmm. All right. Type in an anger. I apologize. In a rut. In a rut, gifted five. Woo! Let's go. Come on, my face. John's Hotel Bill episode of Howard is Gold. Yep. Yeah. We watched that not too long ago. Uh, in a rut with another five? Whoa, what? Come on, my face. What? Hmm. 
John looking like a Von Eric with that claw of his. Oh my God. <laughs> Hope it ends the same. Uh, John, ugly inside and out. I'm hot outside like Bob. Is it because you're wearing a leather jacket? Is that why you're hot? <laughs> How much like, copy are you wearing? Something I've noticed about John, he'll start to use a big word, realize he doesn't know what it means mid-thought, and switch to a dumber word. Mm -hmm. It's subtle, but he does it all the time. Love you guys. Skull. Thank you, brother. Thank you for the 20, and uh, great observation. Uh, I am... Uh, Inigo Melendez, you trust my kids. Oh, from Princess Bride. That's right. Thank you, Brock Mac and Cheese. Come visit us in Nashville. Love All Nashville. right. Uh, ha ha, pig face is enriched with heart health after acing his stress test. He'll blow it all by sundown. Thanks, fellas. Thank, Thank you, Helmush. Framke with a super Woo! sticker. Thank you, pal. Appreciate that. Uh, Bilal Bradley for the Pickwick uh, Pub Travel Fund. Thank, Thank you, Bilal. You, Rumple Trench Coat, a Colombo <laughs> podcast. Your heart is perfect, John, which is not a term doctors use for people who've had two strokes already. I prescribe more whippets, <laughs> Coke, and beer. That's Don't so forget funny. the Monster Energy drinks. Also, John had nothing to do with that prank call. The Trump one? What are you talking about? He's the one who brought it home. Yeah. It went viral. Uh, so Vince, the lawyer, Mr. 100% Italian, doesn't know what a fucking mandolin is. It's an <laughs> Italian word, you fool, Vince. You tell him, Jack. Fucking poser. I know he's a Jew. I know he is. Mm -hmm. He can lie all he wants. That fucker's last name was Lipschitz before he fucking picked this new one. <laughs> Many high IQ people tend to be bored easily and pursue different vocations like music, stand-up comedy, and making crappy art out of $100 <laughs> bills. Indian bra. Thank you, my man. Nine months. Love that, dude. Bob's long dog. Surely I pay and you claim I'm Vince the lawyer? What gives, man? Is it possible to be fans of you both? I like Carl, too. Are you blocking Bob from Bob and Vince show? Okay. I don't remember accusing you of being Vince, but sometimes we make that we say that as a joke. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, if I offended you, uh, <laughs> well, why would I offend you? You're a fan of his. So what yeah. are you complaining about exactly? And then uh, are you blocking Bob? For, no, Bob can do whatever show he wants. Bob's his own man. Having Joe edit out all the Vince the Lawyer uh, starring John segments is very amateur in my honest opinion. Joe also blocked two of my accounts. I'm not Vince the lawyer. I am a vet who uh hoorah. On, oh hoorah on a tight budget. Okay. But why do you need multiple accounts? Hmm. Interesting. Monsters plus beers equal bad for AFib. Third stroke hmm. on the way. Vito Bandito checking in. Uh, Kinky Loco, Carl's lie about not stealing from Vince the lawyer is classic. What did Carl st steal or not steal? What is that one? Did you know Stuttering John's teacher pay is public? 16877 in 2022? Yeah. Right. Uh, Carl, we grew up in the same town. Why do you act so big league? Vince did the narc things uh, 12, six months ago. 12, six months so ago. So weird, you can't admit it. Vince did the narc thing. What's the narc thing? I don't know. I don't know, Kinky. I'm sorry, pal. I'm trying to figure it out, but I'm lost. Also, bad for AFib. Uh, love equals uh, dehydration and screaming and stress. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, hey, guys, not sure if someone else pointed this out, but the bruises on the sides of his lips might be from Botox injections. Ooh, so wow. the doctor. <gasps> oh, wake Carl up. Get him back in here. <laughs> wow. Uh, kinky, surely these edits leave out Vince the lawyer good parts. All right. Duly noted, Kinky. Thank now, you. And remember how I was it? Yeah, today where I said that his tea looked like it was there <laughs> even when it wasn't there. If maybe he had. You're right. You're right. Maybe he got it touched up. Whoa. When John goes in uh, the, 
the doctor. Into the is doctor stressed. is stressed. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Uh, he had a, a doctor appointment, but it was for Ozempic script re-up. Mm. <laughs> that would be great. FYI, Carl docks frog four times on point dabble point. God damn it. I thought it was in Discord he was doing it. Melissa Young gifting one. Thank you, Melissa. Thank you. Thank you. Flexy. Love me some flex. Down under. Uh, you- let's see. I know Dustin from Colorado that worked for Vince the lawyer. Okay. Mm-hmm. Cool. Carl, who was a source when you text MJ about stuttering junk. Carl, who was a who was source when you text Oh, that was a question for Carl. Sorry. Uh John's uh PI is Ray Perbutt. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I don't think that's a real hey. person. <laughs> Kate Meany told Stuttering John her boyfriend shot two of his fingers off with the gun. <laughs> skull. What? That can't be accurate. When I type Kmart, it auto corrects to Janet. Just saying, our lady Kmart and I one in the same? Hmm. No, we're not. Let's hope not. Uh, Zen lost his planchette. Carl, if you want a squeegee board, I'll send you uh, the one. That Bob didn't want. <laughs> but thanks, thank, thank you, Weezy Azilla. If so, uh, yes, get it to a uh, Carl. Yeah, yeah. I tune, I tune down for a half a step. Stuttering John <laughs> tunes down beyond music. <laughs> yeah. There you go, mm-hmm. Jimmy Anderson. How many nicknames has he created for you guys and not stuck mm-hmm. with FSJ and Cheers? John also watched shit off Howard's shoes, mm-hmm. boots, even even worse. And thank you, Jimmy. Good to see you, pal. OG around here. Uh, Spiteful Joe editing out anything with Vince the lawyer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how we roll. So boring. Cool. Glad you made up accounts to say this. (laughs) KC did a list. I had him put you in. What's the list? Vertical. Sexiest Jews, I think. Thank you. That was Kinky Loco, not... Kinky Loco. It's a bit, ah, I got yeah. you. Shocking. Hmm. Shocking. He's all he's all hopped up on his wine, on his <laughs> vagina juice. John said something very telling a bit back. He said that lawsuits are all he has to try to get back at people. Mm-hmm. Ryan, great point. And it's all he had. Like he looks at a lawsuit as like a lottery ticket mm-hmm. or like uh, you know, a really great paying job. He hopes to land one. He hopes to get it. Yeah. Oh my God. I mean, beyond desperate. It's it's a cry for attention. It really is. Uh, St- Brian Stut Joe's entire stress test story is bullshit. Docs have you come in fasting, and results take a few days. Unfortunately, I know these things. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Listen, the minute he tries to sell you on something, anybody who's been through it or knows of it knows it's full he's full of shit you Mm -hmm. just know for a guy again for a guy who's been lying as long as he has you'd think he'd be better at it but he's not um well i think it's uh, he tells so many that i guess uh, statistically he does pretty well i guess we'll never really know right right that's the thing so anywho Uh, Listen, everybody, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Thank you to Carl uh, for popping in here. Boys in the back. I mean, great job again. Great package. Great work. They got to sit through all this shit. Shout out to them. Uh, We will be back tomorrow. So on your way out, if you don't mind, hit like, hit subscribe. Thank you for getting us over 18,000 subscribers. Really appreciate that. And and, and remember up. Ah, thank you to Mule. Yes. Yes. Well, let's try and get Mule on tomorrow night with us. I'd love that. That would be fun. Yeah. Uh, all right. I'm playing. I'm playing for Shuli on KC's list. What's the list? What's the list? Tell me what the list is. Yeah. I'm playing for Shuli on KC's list. Hmm. I hear KC's making a list. I feel like it's the opposite of Schindler's list. I feel like this is. He's not putting lipstick on when he's writing these names down, is he? <laughs> All right, we'll figure it out. G-Rob, thank you. Hit like on your way out. Hit subscribe. Thank you to everybody who super chatted. Thank you if you signed up on your own, membered up, or if you gifted. You guys rock. 
We'll see you tomorrow. We're out. That's all for the Uncle Rico Show. That's all for the Uncle Rico Show. Grab one more beer and shout out. Go! Good.